ass. The butt steak. <laughs> Gotta eat more ass, and man. Live. Eat ass. LGC butt sticks. Going live. <laughs> Hot, <laughs> clappy steaks. Live butt sticks. Live butt sticks are best butt sticks. What's up? Live I promise. Hot butt sticks are I waiting for you in your neighborhood. Dude, this, this, Click on this link. You said you were your going. Credit card. Man, you promised me you were going to adult this evening. The hell. <laughs> I, I, no I made promise. no such promise. <laughs> in my imagination, you promised me. I mean, in my imagination, you promised me to give me 50 bucks. So, I mean. I give you 50 bucks, man. It's like. <laughs> go, wait. Do you want 50 US? I'll give you like 50 Canadian. That's like. Oh, I'll, I'll take 50 US. I mean, either, either works for me. <laughs> it's win win. Yeah. <laughs> either way, it's 50 bucks I didn't have before, so. Right. Hey, beautiful people, what's going on? We're getting ready for another Linux Gamecast Weekly that Pedro is about to change on Twitch. I, I'm, yep. I'm on it. I'm going. <laughs> I'm, ar or I'm already there. Going. Yeah, well, okay. if, if you're going to do it, do it right. Don't half-ass it. That's what yeah, I'm pre I'll do it. Dozen. Don't worry. All right. Just talking or chatting, whatever the fuck it's called. Uh, talk shows, podcast. Yeah, talk you could podcast, do gaming right. talk shows. Yeah. <laughs> All right, talk shows, podcast, Linux Gamecast free shows and live. Updated. All yes. right. Now I'll override yours. <laughs> Oh, yeah. It is already December here. No, it's not. Wait, yes, it is. <laughs> Boo! <laughs> there! We've done everything there. all professional like. Yeah. All professional like? Yep. <laughs> like 20, like. possibly 23% professional like. Guaranteed. Twenty three percent professional or or, or more. Or, 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 or. Now with X two technology. The, the the more errs you have, the more professional it is. <laughs> That's our motto, man. Pine books look nifty. Whoa, 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 Scott. Let, let's let, 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 dial it back a bit. Yeah, <laughs> more, maybe, maybe like point two three percent satisfaction guaranteed. There we go. <laughs> Don't go writing asses or checks can't cash. Not unless they're not unless Pedro's gonna eat them first. <laughs> that was good. A seven ten. Mm. Ooh, I don't think that's an upgrade. <laughs> oh, it's I mean, a GS. It, Never mind. It is an upgrade. <laughs> it, it, it it is it is an upgrade. I mean, it's it's a marginal upgrade, but still technically an upgrade. <laughs> I, th yeah. I think you're you're in Man, the gigabytes the of VRAM at that, that point. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, no, they, the uh, the uh, eight eight thousand series they beat that into the ground, man. Yeah, I the think GT up until, like, series eight thousands yeah. were good. The GS is not so much. <laughs> no, it was like even uh, up to the um, I think it was up to the GTS two hundred series or GTX two hundred series. They were still rocking that eighty eight hundred uh, architecture. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then they skipped the um, GTX 800 series, uh, except for laptops. But then again, that was just the 700 series. Oh, it finally went out of stock. <laughs> finally. Huh. Yeah, Steam controller, out of stock. Ah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Context. Yeah, no, it's yeah, been out of stock like in the Jordan. UK for a few days. <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't know. At least, at least with me, there's like the pretense of it might be connected to the previous thing I just said, but you know, whatever. Sometimes. 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 It's it's fifty it's fifty as opposed to oh, and it's out of stock. See, clever oh, people are like, check. oh, I wonder. Uh, <laughs> yes. I thought you were talking about soup. That's your own damn problem, man. Must be us. Because I want soup. I thought you wanted ribeye. <laughs> I, I can have two things. No. I'm a big boy. No, I, can, uh, I can eat more than one meal. You have to mono once only. Thank you well, very much, Lockdown, for want, the limited I, I edition controller that then. you got me. <laughs> I wonder... Oh, goddammit. Now you gotta Google that. 
ribeye soup. <laughs> yeah. I, I I don't think you'd actually put it in soup because it's not like a bone, right? You can, maybe well, you can rib. just cut out uh, the fat and drop it in the pan to like season no. it. <laughs> Beef ribeye and vegetable soup or stew, stoop, stew, stew. <laughs> poor stew. More poor Would stew. Would you stew to such levels as to make soup with ribeye? I mean. That's a pretty expensive soup. <laughs> Some people are like really into the, I mean, steak soup in general, dude. Uh, what, what do you call it? St uh, Stan Efferding actually recommends you, uh, recommends uh, chicken stock over beef stock because um, chicken bone, chicken stock tends to be made with more like joints. And so there's more collagen in the broth. It's easier to squeeze chicken. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah, if you're, you're trying to squeeze a cow it's made before. with more joints means they're all high as they're cooking. Yeah. It just boils down to the simple fact that, you know, cows fight back. <laughs> Chickens will fight back, too. <laughs> they're just they're just smaller than you, so it's not that bad. <laughs> unless, unless you got some, like, Shadow of the Colossus-style chicken who, like, climbs up on you and starts pecking your eyes out. <laughs> That'd be your luck, like, dude. You'd be like, hi, I got the chicken. <laughs> and you're like, oh, this is just the bobby. Shows up chicken with a mana bar. Oh, no, no, yeah, you get, you get like the Dark Souls like health bar just expands over <laughs> top. You're like, ah, oh, shit. <laughs> that would be great if that was like a thing in real life where you're just walking up to something and then you just like see its health bar just expand in front of you. You're like, okay, backing off now. I'm gonna go that way. <laughs> AR, AR is gonna get that way, man. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> When you think about it, dude, I mean, if you get, like, some basic, like, vital sensing, you, you could bring up some type of health bar. Some sort of <laughs> HP bar. <Right. laughs> and then you I, look I, at I, someone's I, like, oh, I'm sorry. It's like, why? You have cancer. How the f- How did you, you know? Because <laughs> you got the cancer status. Like, it's little, it's little purple <laughs> dot over your health bar. Yeah, you got the little thing next to your HP bar. It's like, fuck you. <laughs> Cancer does three damage around. Yeah, I saw that Linux Nero. That, that was a. Uh, oops. I'm sure you said things. Yeah, we, we, we saw your mouth moving. I mean, Jordans just get quiet because Chrome did a thing. Yeah. And... Chrome shat itself. Yeah. I, I straight up had to switch browsers, so. <laughs> So, who all bought a Steam controller? I want to know. I know I bought another I, one. I thought about it. I thought about it, but I couldn't could, bring myself. Oh, they didn't know. You couldn't have gotten in Canada. It wasn't. Uh, uh, yeah, Canada was excluded from the 90% uh, off. Boo! Yeah. Well. <laughs> I was like. <sighs> Basil, you got one. Right on. So, apparently, Shay uh, bought one, but yeah. Yeah. Uh, you get denied? Oh, but Linda got one. Yeah, Joe they, got, they one. got a refund. Mir got one. <laughs> Adiho. Weeba, weeba Adios. hi, weeba <laughs> madeho. Um, I bought five bucks, man. Even with shipping, it was like fourteen. Yeah, that's it's pretty good. Did they did they do like a limit one per customer thing or? Uh... I I didn't check because it goes against everything, in, like in my genetics to buy something I don't need. <laughs> so the, I I won that battle, so I didn't push it. I was like, no, you just need. But yeah, I I think the, no, the limit was four. Yeah. Yeah. The by the time I sent uh, Dave the email, which was like when the sale started, it's like, yo, Steam controller is four pounds. Hmm. It's like, oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna buy ones, and the next day got into work. It's like they were out of stock. Oh, okay. <laughs> Once again, don't try and make a soup with your Steam controller. <laughs> the one thing I was... I'm going to bring this up at the beginning of the show, but... It... The way I justified it to myself is like, maybe I'll get one with that doesn't require, you know, tool-assisted battery removal. <laughs> <laughs> because Pedro's I like, oh, look, my battery just comes out. I, can, I have, you have to get something to jam in there and, like, dig the battery out. Jordan, you have the same model as mine. 
Yes, I do. Yes. And that, yeah, no. Uh-uh. Yeah, no, that, 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 that t- <laughs> no. for me, that takes like about five minutes of squeezing yeah. or like Ben says, <laughs> grab, grab a probe, Flat grab like and, a, like a yeah. screwdriver or something and jam it in there. That is, I'm just saying <laughs> this one works. <laughs> the batteries are dead in this and they remain dead because I was like, you know what? I don't feel like it, man. Traumatize your yeah. thumbs. <laughs> That, that Seriously, locked on, and thank you. It's limited edition now. Thanks. <laughs> oh, jeez, dude. Yeah. Well, that's my plan. I'm going to keep one of them like in the box and sell it to like a retro gaming enthusiast in a few years. <laughs> Corded pad thingy. Oh, someone liked the comment I left on YouTube. <laughs> Steam soup is basically water. Help, help me out, Pedro. What was the comment about? Oh, oh that uh, was your notification. Was on, uh... See, I put things together. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it was. I left a comment on um, Internet Comment Etiquette's video. Hmm. Because he said, it's like, yo, you need to pay attention to this video. It's like, okay, I'll pay attention to your video. And... The whole video, I went through it, not even, you know, finding it chuckle-worthy. And then uh, he got to the end, and he did the uh, fake tit-slapping thing. It's like, uh, oh, okay, that's funny. <laughs> the, um... I saw a dude... This was, like, right before we went live for the pre pre Super Shows, and was... He posted in, like, our Black Magic design, and he's like, here's my video on DaVinci, which I was like, oh, this is how you align separate audio with video and I was like oh this has got to be something new thank you Billa for the bits <laughs> neat and so Jordan yes how would you go about aligning separate audio with video in an NLE uh, I mean I'd, I'd probably look for like a sync point right like there you go so- yeah right you would waveforms right yeah, I, 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 I'd, I'd listen to it. I tried to like ma- find something that like so, someone going through a menu or something and line that up. I think that would be the the traditional way with like any NLE in the world is basically mm-hmm. that you have a visual look of like the recorded waveform. You know, a spike. Yep. You look for a nice peak, then you look for the waveform in the video itself, and you line it. And that's what the guy showed on the video. And he was like, "Yeah, no nonsense. This is how it gets done." I had to type in. I had to type in the comments, but I was really nice about it. I was like, "If you highlight the audio and video, and you right click, there's a button that will do all that automatically." Exonotic. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. It's like Xenotic, <laughs> but with a lisp. Xenotic. <laughs> yeah. Exonotic. <laughs> Nova, you're in the right company, buddy. We're we're all children here, men, children, woman, children. Yeah, the, our minds stopped developing children. when we hit like twelve. So, the the, yeah. the, the, <laughs> the unifying theme here is that we're all mentally eight. <laughs> Quit bragging. <laughs> Fine, seven and a half. Jesus Christ. I am these years old. <laughs> I I can't count my age on my fingers and toes anymore. <laughs> Moral of the story, I need to grow more toes. <laughs> Go stand in a pool of radioactive voice then. <laughs> no, no, no. Done oh. and done. Let's see. Alright, so we got about a minute, so if anyone needs to go grab a drink, do it. I has drink. You has drink. <laughs> I, I got enough drink to get through the I did it already. How dare you, sir? <laughs> I dare by doing this. Yeah. You took time off from making your ribeye soup. Yeah, I'm. Not, I'm, just, I'm just gonna blend it and drink it. Mmm. Meat slurry. If it's good enough for Eugene, it's good enough for me. Right. Three IPA in the fridge, twelve percent alcohol. I'm sorry, that's not beer. That's that's wine. barley wine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's not beer, it's cold 45. It's malt liquor. 
That's somebody dodging dealing with alcoholism. <laughs> yep. <laughs> or so, hops wine, as the case may like, be. I didn't yeah. drink a bottle of wine. I drink six little bottles of wine. <laughs> And here I thought I was uh, being a bit uncouth with my 6.6. .6. Mm. <laughs> Two, three, and four. All right. <laughs> it is time to do it to it. It's time for crime. Do people still say do it to it? I do, but I do it ironically, so I don't know. Well, like... Okay, if it's still used, like, even ironically, that's good. Do it, do it. I haven't heard anyone say that here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Diet soft drink. <laughs> Allegedly. Was that German? It sounded German. <laughs> what? <laughs> of everything that's been said thus far, that's the thing that got you to look. <laughs> it, it, it It's just, just when I think the bar's on the floor, you show up with a shovel. <laughs> it's been seven years. Not even a shovel. You show up with, like, excavation <laughs> equipment. Like, heavy, heavy machinery. <laughs> With like an auger or something. Right. <laughs> <laughs> ah, the beggar two eight eight arms that you hack off an enemy in near. <laughs> it's a drill. Drill baby. Seems good. All right. Do do hast. Nanorama sounds like something you contract. Which I guess in a way. Done. Thank you for the bits. I think you're done. <laughs> bits are good, right? Yeah, they're yes. like, what is it like? A one bit a is cent like per a pit. Pen, a penny, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Tuppence. Tuppence! Suck it, Strider, with your 25 grand. I got 10 bits, bitch. <laughs> Spoilers! Oh, right. I don't think the internet knows. You're right. No. My bad. We're recording. <clears throat> no, we're recording in two places. Terrifying. God damn it. I know. <laughs> in three, two... And welcome back to another Linux Gamecast Weekly, the show that covers the latest Linux gaming news, reviews, how-tos, and most importantly, whatever the hell else we come up with. What's up, beautiful people? Oh, Jesus. Look at that. I am the triangle. <laughs> the triangle man. my triangle. Triangle man doing whatever. <laughs> oh, the Jordan bits. <laughs> it's terrifying. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> I'm Ben Stone. That, not to be confused with the triangle, this is the one Jordan's thing in over there. I l Listen, you've never seen the triangle and me in the same place at the same time. I just it's gotta be the same did, person. sweetheart. That is Pedro Mateus, man. It is kind of beautiful. <laughs> with you at home, joining us live, helping us form Cocaine Voltron. That's right. What's up, people, man? We got a big, big show. A lot of Linux gaming news to cover this week. But before we do that, let's take a nice walk down memory lane and find out what Pedro was up to this week. Well, uh, I've been playing around with uh, this thing. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Surface. It's... Um... Yeah, it, it it's still jank. No matter what I do, the uh, gnome uh, on-screen keyboard keeps uh, sometimes not showing up properly. You kind of have to click away from it or tap away from it and then tap into text field again for it to show up properly. Uh, though I've been using Wayland a lot, and Wayland in this particular medium works very well. It works much better than X, especially when you rotate the device and the uh, accelerometer shifts the screen orientation. 
it's much quicker and much nicer with uh, yeah. with Wayland than it is with X. So that was, yeah. that, was, that was the thing I noticed with the touchscreen on my laptop, though, was like I couldn't really tell the difference between Wayland and X in terms of performance. But yeah, it's a laptop and not like a tablet. So there's no yeah. like, orientation <laughs> switching or whatnot. So that, that's that's interesting to hear. That's but like cool. it, it worked out of the box, right? Like pick, picked up that there's it a touchscreen. Uh, on the surface, it didn't work out of the box. You need a custom kernel, at least for this ah. model. With the ah. older models like uh, ver- uh, Generation 3 and Generation 4, those work out of the box. But yeah, this one still needs a patched kernel. There's a mm. someone created a GitHub repo that has a script that basically does everything for you, which is nice. It's really nice. <laughs> Jordan, what's new with you, baby? Absolutely nothing, because I was going to complain about something, and then I was <laughs> informed that I was just wrong, mm. and was presented with the evidence to back it up, and so now I don't have anything to complain about. Man. <laughs> Don't you hate it when that happens? <laughs> I just hate everything in general. That, that's just always my life. a safe bet. Not much going on here. I'm waiting. I was hoping uh, the sequel to my Steam controller was going to show up. It's going to show up tomorrow because I got that for like five dollars plus shipping and handling. I saw people online legitimately complaining. If you didn't know, it was ninety percent off. I think they're all sold out everywhere. Not in Canada. Just not in Canada, man. <laughs> F you, Canada. You can't have them. Um, it's going to be a story. We're going to talk about it. Anyway, I was excited to get another one because hopefully I'll get one that doesn't require tool assisted battery removal. Unlike the horse, which each and every week requires a screwdriver to be shoved in it ever so slowly. To be, to be fair, the, the horse doesn't need any sort of tool assistance because it's a big enough tool on its own. It's the steam. Let us update the Sail. Dun, 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 yes. dun, dun. 2019 autumn sale is it's upon us lads we we get to oh we get to nominate shit too man the steam awards well, yeah they do the steam awards at the end of the year and now you get to nominate them nom 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 uh nom, nom, nom. i'm gonna be honest uh really i this whole thing the only thing i bought was that steam controller and it was not from lack of trying to find things to spend money on it's we, it's sale fatigue, right? Like, yeah, you you kind of had a point with that, right? At, I I mean, like, I I ran into this a few years ago because, like, I, I keep saying I'm very very picky when it comes to like the games I buy and the things I will like invest my time into. And after a while, like, if there's not really much in the way of exciting new releases that like we don't get to play for this show, then at the end of the year when these sales come up, I'm just like, okay. This is on sale. That's cheap. That's cheap. Am I going to play it? Maybe for five minutes? Do I want to drop... Do I even want to drop $5 on it? Not really. The... Did, did you see anything, Pedro, that was like... Just, oh, I might buy... It. Oh, I, the only thing there that... There were... Okay, here's one thing I didn't buy out of principle. And it, I don't even know. The Witcher 3. Diamond face. Yes, more diamonds for Jordan. Thank Deal you. Deal with it, Jordan. Um, but yeah, one of the things I noticed is um, if you're not us and you don't have, you know, a bunch of games already laying around and you're actually looking, if you go to our curator page, the games we've recommended up to this point, there's a couple of nice sales in there. Um, Shadow of the Tomb Raider is like 67% off. So if you don't have that game yet, that's pretty recent. It came out earlier this year or late mm-hmm. last year. That's That's a very nice game and it's now... Linux native, but it works very well. Thanks, Farrell. Um, so, yeah, no, uh, that is an example. There's more there. That there will be a link for that in the show notes. But yeah, it, for us, it's kind of slim pickings. Not much there. But what do we think about the discontinuation of the Steam Control? Jordan, you had some thoughts, like maybe. Well, the, it, I mean, I've consulted the Wheel of Booga Booga. I've, I've spun it a few times, and it seems it seems to keep landing on. There may or may not be a Steam Controller 2 coming. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe. May have. Depends on how haps. focused they are on the whole VR thing. What do you want in, like, Steam Controller 2, Electric Horse Salute? Because the two things. Give me a second, D-pad. This is not... Okay, A, this makes excellent remote, by the way. Um, but analog stick, I'd be very happy with another one of these. Maybe slightly bigger buttonholes. And... And... A built-in battery. I know it was a... Pitch- yeah, built-in rechargeable battery. Rechargeable or, or- battery. To finish that thought, though, because I know it was like, but then, man, screwdriver. You can replace LiPo cells. This is not that hard. Just don't glue it in. 
well. True, but I, I was I was gonna say like act as a charger for like standard rechargeable batteries. That would be a nice touch. Yeah, that'd uh, be nice. Mm. Um, what one one thing I'd like it, it was the thing that the smock promised that I thought was actually a really cool idea. But like being able to pop off the um, the touch pads and replace them with like buttons or sticks or something. Yes, that, like some because <laughs> like. Val- Valve uh, made available like the the schematics for like 3D printers, right? Mm-hmm. So it'd be cool to sort of enable more extensibility of the Steam controller as a platform to like better support various games, right? Right. Hmm. And for me, I guess the uh, the big one would be to swap positions between the face buttons and the right areola. The right areola could very well be where the face buttons are, and then you'd have bigger, more prominent buttons where the right areola is. I, I would very much like that. It so I I I, th- I think that's either a consequence of the fact that they kind of wanted to have like the programmable touchpads on the same level, or there may be there may be a copyright thing involved with like how the Xbox controller is laid out. I don't know. Well, if I, we get it's that, got a touch maybe pad some instead lasers. Of a we'll, we'll be good that's... with it, man. Oh, Possibly. Pedro, you did want to give everyone a mention that if you are looking for some things that we liked and that's on sale, yes. As I mentioned earlier, um, go check out our uh, curator list and every game that we've thrown at least three chairs at, or maybe there was one of us that didn't like a particular game, but the sentiment was generally positive, then uh, there you go. There's the list. There, there's a lot of puzzle games in there because apparently we like puzzle games. Apparently, right? It's kind of weird go to figure. go back and like, <laughs> look through that. Uh, but... Easy to say. We're definitely across the board, man. We we have very like some of those games. I'm like, yeah, yeah, it's actually surprisingly a good game, and it's always nice to find yep. that, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Indeed. All right. Well, you know what? You may you one of the reasons you may not be finding games you want to spend money on in the sale is because a bunch of them got nuked. Yeah, oh, about, <laughs> you mean over, artichoke over th- <laughs> clicker is no longer on the stage. No. Oh, so uh, so. Val- Valve surreptitiously removed about a thousand what sixteen uh, apps, including DLC, uh, from the store. They're all they're all related to this this one publisher, uh, Dagestan mm-hmm. Technologies. Um, apparently, there was some stuff going on. the 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 line from Valve was that they were abu- There were a bunch of developers and publishers abusing Steamworks, and so if they're going to abuse our platform, they can't use our platform anymore. Um, and most of the games seemed removed, seemed to be kind of jank, but there were a couple well-received ones like Electronic Highways that I guess maybe used one of these companies as a publisher that got nuked as well. The thing, the thing here is that there's if you if you go through the Reddit thread, if you go through the PC game article, there's a lot of speculation because Valve hasn't really said much, so we have no real concrete information. Uh, reg- um, aside from the fact that yeah, Steam Steamworks abuse, whatever that happens to mean, maybe they're just generating a bunch of cards to sell. I know that's a fairly frequently occurring issue right. in the Steam marketplace, yeah. car, trading card abuse. So we don't we don't know, but uh, I do believe that these ones have actually been removed from libraries as well. Normally, if like Steam delists the game, mm. they're uh, they uh, yeah, still let you the, download these it, weren't but... just you know we're not going to be dealing with this particular publisher anymore. These were banned. They were yeah. outright banned. Uh-huh. I, we don't yeah, like Jordan was saying, we don't know why because it's Valve and they don't have any investors to please, so none of the information is you know public. But it, yeah, apparently a bunch of these games were being published by the same people, just that one publishing place. And it wasn't all above board. Well, you know, if we go by what's been going on recently, we'd be like, eh, money laundering. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> most likely. <laughs> I kind of had my hopes up because, you know, normally if you can track it, you know, they'll, they'll get like, this is not unusual, like per month, usually about 100, 120. They do take off, but this was like, nope, Mageddon. I was like, finally, steam cleaning. That's going to be a thing. But yeah, as Jordan, you brought up, man, it's just like particularly like one particularly bad actor. So mm. App- apparently they were registered as like a bunch of different publishers as right. well, like Siberian Technologies or something like that. So, hmm. well, they didn't take off any of the top releases from October. Nope. <laughs> no, they didn't. Then again, that, that'd be a bit um, glaring. But yeah, with this one, they say they have a little bit at the top. It's like, 
yeah, with this, uh, with this, uh, in this month, they had four games either leaving or entering early access. Ten developers bringing a product to Steam for the first time. Thirteen different countries represented by developers this month, and thirteen games with some level of controller support. That is vague as balls. <laughs> but uh, the like, the first one that appears in the uh, in the list is Destiny Two or um, Ben your Linux using ass. But uh, why that is a bestseller is a very good question, because it's a free-to-play game now, so... uh. Then there's Indivisible, Trine 4, which we will have to get to at some point. Well, Uh, Trine Trine 4 is not a Linux game. Let's let's be real. It'll it'll run via Proton, but not a Linux game. Rosenbite, tap the note button on that one. What about Secret Neighbor? That sounds not Secret, Secret Neighbor is not a Linux game. It, it's just uh, Jackbox, Indivisible, Tavern Simulator, which, by the way, apparently has a nudity tag, so I'm very interested in some medieval oh, uh, tavern If you boobies. go and look at the screenshots in the community tab, you'll see why. Yeah, buddy. It doesn't take very long. Hot elf <laughs> on elf Pedro action. That sounds um, horrifyingly <laughs> delightful. Yeah. <laughs> Good to see. We got a new version of Proton, though. We do, uh, version 4.11-9. Uh, they fixed the performance regression that was supposedly present in uh, 4.11-8 that affected 32-bit games only that used the XVK and D9 VK. Uh, apparently, there were no 32-bit games using VK3D because, well, that's a thing. Uh, the uh, Apparently, uh, there was a fix reporting too little GPU memory for certain GPUs, so I guess the issue wasn't that the 970 was presenting itself as uh, 4 gigabytes. Not letting that go anywhere. No, you, 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 you weren't Not getting that last go 500 megs. You, 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 <laughs> you only get three. Um, the, the, the other one that comes with this is um, those of you who are... Like the four of you on Linux who have driving wheels and play racing games, Yay. you get some force feedback now, uh, which yep. means that if you're if you're going to be using the Proton in the next story, too fucking bad, Ben. Can you bad. imagine the, the like that's your jam and you've just dealt with it and you're like ah no force feedback, like, that's going to and then jack you start you a up, game and right? all of a sudden the uh, the wheel goes. What the hell? <laughs> you think about it, man. You, you like one pinky driving, you're like getting used to it, and maybe holding, I don't know, hot beverage. Then <laughs> it's like, eh, and, that's and, a and that's how you, that's how you have to buy a second driver over wheel. the floor. Because <laughs> you, you, you got your Starbucks in one hand, you got the wheel in the other hand, and then you're like, God! Too real. <laughs> oh, man. But, uh,. We get GE Proton. That's no thing. Glorious Egg Roll Proton. This is this is a neat little project where they're trying to apply Proton patches on top of the latest and greatest mainline wine, which in this case is whoop for twenty. Um, they did a bit of law wrangling here uh, mm. in this release because you know Glorious Egg Roll isn't as brave as Strider, so he's not going to be shipping Microsoft code that he doesn't really own. Um, anything that's really available will get downloaded as part of the build process. But yeah, don't go shipping code that you don't have the rights to distribute. Um, yeah, so, I mean, it makes sense, right? Because the intention of this project is they are intending to upstream stuff to Proton. Um, yep. Yeah, I'll, 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 get, I'll get to that one then. Um, <laughs> but yeah, the, the intent of this project is to upstream steps to regular Proton so that um, Valve will have an easier time getting new stuff working um, with that support via the latest version of Wine. Um, a, a part, according to this one, you can alt-tab again, but, you know, we'll cause the XFCE bar to show up. Even if you Yay. don't have XFCE installed, question yep. mark. Hundred percent of the time, baby. That's how we get new recruits. Yeah, that, that's, <laughs> cue, cue the X Files theme, Surprise man. I want to believe XFCE bar. Like, what the hell is like? It's too late. It's too late. <laughs> don't fight it. Like, I was using rat poison. It. You're using XFCE <laughs> now, buddy. Uh, I installed this. One thing we don't point out: uh, this is back to a binary release. Before this, the past chunk of releases were not. But you had to build it from source. And I looked at that. It's like. Even me, it's like, nope, that's not happening. But you could download this again. It was like some legal thing um, on yeah. top of this, but installed it. Hope of hopes, but still no goddamn Batman. I'm pretty sure yeah. every, everyone, especially <laughs> Feral, is trying to pretend that that never existed. I won't play with Feral. <laughs> uh, Feral is currently sitting looking at what they, the build that they had ready to go and mm-hmm. going motherfuckers uh but <laughs> to be yeah to be the, fair, they did their best and it still runs at like 27 frames a second yeah yeah <laughs> but the big thing about uh, proton ge was and that was a reason i had it uh was that it included the media foundation stuff already 
good to go. Basically, you just changed from regular Proton to Proton GE, and it mm -hmm. went, look, all the Media Foundation games all of a sudden now work properly. So there goes the whole point of me actually using this, because I could just tell Proton tricks to... It's like this game, yeah, install the Media Foundation stuff there. Well, maybe I don't, I don't want my Proton turning tricks, son. <laughs> Well, uh, you can do it via regular wine I want tricks as well. Family so. oriented, all right. Basically, family, you're family, not going to get around on. the tricks. Oh, dude. Hey, but it's yeah, really, uh, uh, with, with I'm that. sure Valve appreciates like these guys actually sticking their neck out to test the new <laughs> versions. But oh yeah, Val it, Valve totally yeah. loves people doing their work for them. Absolutely, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's free labor, brilliant. baby. Free labor. I... I think regular Proton's going to be good enough, but definitely try this if there's a particular game that will take advantage of some of the fixes in there. Yep. Yeah, yeah, like they're, like they're 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 saying stuff like uh, Mortal Kombat 11 and like Final Fantasy Type Zero, American Fugitive, all that crap. Yeah, the, uh, those are the media foundation games. Yeah. So mm -hmm. there you go. Um, mm -hmm. Coming up next, if you've ever wondered what almost thirty thousand dollars of marijuana looks like, me too. Me too. Yes, family friendly. <laughs> family friendly. I mean, like, mafia family friendly, for sure. <laughs> if you want to be a member of our weird incestuous family, you can head on to vote.linuxgamecast.com and vote on some show titles. Yep. <laughs> Let's see what we have. We got Hell Elks, of course. We're all children here. Rise of the Mental Apes. Steam Soup. Steam Soup. Dra Dragulama. Squeeze and Chicken. Butt Steak. Egg Roll. Elf on Pedro Action. Steam Cleaning. <laughs> Artichoke Clicker. Electric Horsaloo. Nom Nom Nominate. Rib Stoop. Doop. And Stoop. You could do with a bit more volume, Pedro. A bit more volume. Oh, the city. And start monitoring. Okay. So if I'm just talking into this microphone, I'm going slightly above minus 12. See, when you're That's doing where... that, you got enough volume. That, okay. however, is not how you talk during a show. Hey, okay. <laughs> Let's raise this a little bit, and if I talk now, it's going slightly above minus nine if I'm doing this thing, what I'm doing right now. But if I'm just talking normally, it goes around, well, it stays around minus 15 and minus 12, so I guess bring it up, that. Bring it up higher. Give me more. Okay, I'm going to give it a little more. That was probably too much because now it's going know. between minus 12 and minus 9. Uh, actually, say some things. Hey? Okay, I'm going to say things and I'm going to look at these uh, words that are on screen right now. Many games require MF Blatt functionality that does not come with Proton on normal wine. It is very likely that without these libraries, some games will not function properly. The games that currently rely on MF Blatt and may be affected... Um, by the changes in the above mentioned notice are MK11, Spyro, Reignited Trilogy, Monster Hunter World, Blast Blue Central Fiction, Chris, Chris, I got you locked. Gree. You're good. Okay. <laughs> it's pronounced Gree. Oh <laughs> Spoiler alert. <laughs> okay. Will AMD do 12.8? I don't know. What is 12.8? That sounds hot. 12 cores, 8 threads. 12, oh, fuck yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, 128, I, 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 they already did. Uh, the Epic processor did 
Yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> 12, 12 cores, 8 threads. Oh, are you talking about the W the Gen 2 WX series thread rubbers? Because yeah, those uh those, those are missing some memory controllers. <laughs> no, the the Gen 3 Epics. You know, the ones they released first. Cause they saw, oh you guys want more uh performance. Alright, here we go. <laughs> Download some more RAM. It's the best way to do it. <laughs> but yeah, apparently the 3950X is sold out everywhere. I Much mean, to the I surprise guess of absolutely no one. Which you got I guess technically with, with the Stadia, you can download more RAM. <laughs> yeah. Resident Evil. Yeah, see, The Witcher. Like, it made me, but I'm just not buying that out of principle. I already have my copy. Yeah, you got it with the uh, video code. 980. I got it with the 980. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I can I can give you my copy. It's DRM free, right? I'm not playing it. Nah. <laughs> Principle. Ah, <laughs> uh, Austin. Austin. Sekiro is still way too expensive. And I finally finished the uh, um, Ringed City DLC in Dark Souls 3, which means all I have to do now is kill the Soul of Cinder, which I've been putting off for a while. Basically, I go into the game, I help other people do it, and I just don't do it. <laughs> in my own game. <laughs> Soul Cinder's the final boss, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> The dude who, like, is basically all the classes at once. Is he? F is yep. it, like, the one boss that's challenging? Uh, it's the final boss of a Dark Souls game. It's not particularly hard. It's just that that one has two phases. It's the first, last boss of a Dark Souls that has two phases. Unless you want to count the three bosses, or four bosses, if you have the, uh, nope. Scholar of the First Can't Sin in Dark out. Souls 2. Quit, quit making assumptions. <laughs> Yeah, in Dark Souls 2, you have to fight two bosses, and then you fight Queen Nishandra, and if you have Scholar of the First Sin, you have to beat the final, final boss. <laughs> uh, and Sekiro is just the next one over, yeah. Until I get my hands on a PS4 to play Bloodborne. Dorbit! Thank you for the sub. <laughs> Now we just need, like, two aircraft carriers and maybe some light, light utility choppers. <laughs> so that we can get to the chopper. That's the only reason to have a chopper. Is to get to it? <laughs> to get to it. <laughs> to get to it. It's like, oh man, I gotta get out of here. Why? Well, I gotta get to the chopper. It's not a motorcycle, it's a chopper. It's a chopper. Zed's dead, baby. Who's Zed? Zed's dead, baby. <laughs> Thank you very much for the sub, Mila. <laughs> now we have two subs. Wait, and it, do yeah. we have a chopper? No, wait. <laughs> no, we, we just have a motorcycle. Is it technically a quad bike now? <laughs> and Mr. Alert! Thank you for the sub. <laughs> I th I'm starting to think y'all just like to watch me eat a banana. Yes. Yeah. That's the With sole pool? purpose of that. <laughs> I'm, I mean, there, there's a reason it's you eating a banana and not me eating a banana, despite the fact that I, I eat actual more bananas on stream. Actual eat. more bananas. I more eat a banana <laughs> every single day with my cereal. And thank you again, Don, for the bits. <laughs> but you're not doing it on stream and you're not making enough eye contact. And that's why you fail. Yes. Oh, thanks, Scott. Much appreciated. Thanks for the sub. Scoot. <laughs> Scoot. So cute. You're all monsters. Yeah. Two I month resub, nonetheless. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's X Salty who's gifted at all these subs. Oh, it's Salty. All right. Okay. Salty, what are you doing? <laughs> he's buying people subs. What do you think he's doing? <laughs> <laughs> okay, then it's Salty who likes to watch me eat bananas. 
You can say bitch, it's Saturday, Jill, it's fine. <laughs> People already say I'm the bitch at work because I'm the one who gets asked to do everything, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, see, Linux Nuru, there's video evidence to the contrary. <laughs> Listen, sometimes Jill gets in fifth place and she gets really heated. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Besides, it's bitch. It's like that curse word that's actually acceptable in certain circumstances. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, uh, uh, Jill's trash talk is, um, it cuts especially deep because you think she's being really nice and then you actually, uh, start paying attention to all the implications behind what she said. It's like, oh, 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 oh,
I gotta, I gotta find out how salty no. it is. <laughs> In three, I'm at the edge of my seat. Two. We hope you're ready for the bit of news that's coming your way. It, it is a chunky bit of news, but chunky before we this, get to that, chunky that. Now it's got peanut yes. butter chunkiness. Well, those are chunky, but eh, close enough. Uh, what, are you, I mean, what are your thoughts what's on an chunky o peanut butter? You? Jordan, are you a fan? Uh, d depends, right? Like if it's for like a sandwich, yeah, I like chunky peanut butter or crunchy peanut butter, I guess it is. I like the crunchy, yeah. <laughs> Did they make like, like extra chunky with this like dip man just put the whole nuts in there? I mean, that's just called <laughs> buying a jar of nuts. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> Fair enough. I mean, I mean, you, you you can you can buy us a jar of nuts if you want. You can head on over to LinuxGameCast.com. We got a menu called Support. It should say nuts, but it doesn't. Support our but nuts. We, Wait. Yes. Yeah, support our nuts, just like a pair of compression shorts. You can do so with Patreon, LibrePay, buying some merch, buying some PayPal stuff. We got wish lists on Amazon. We got some Bitcoin if you want to send us some coin yay. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Imagine yeah, um, money, maybe. Patreon Patreon's the best way to support us. It is. Uh, and you, you get a bunch of cool stuff like uh, Discord access. So you get show note access. You can RSVP to game streams. We did a uh, big old Jack party on Friday, and you could come in and play Jackbox with us. It's pretty good. Uh, we got some people we got to thank there, though. We got Nova King, our latest and greatest pat. Latest, man. Nova rocking the Death Note status. What's up? In Indeed. We, 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 got, we got Steve Husbando. Uh, he used our affiliate <laughs> link to buy a TV, which is pretty nice. Yeah, uh, and, he was uh, very happy with it. He's like, "It's going to be the size of a wall," and like, eh, hopefully, it doesn't show and, up. And, and I, I guess, I guess, some someone wanted to see less of your body, then, so they bought you a llama sweater. Yeah, man. See, the, we were talking about Wednesday, man. Don M, you got to watch out for him. This is why I don't put joke stuff on my wish zone for the studio <laughs> because it it's just like a laser <laughs> attraction. It's like, pff, gone. All right, damn it. All right, fine. I'll wear it. You know what? I yeah. like it. Check it out. <laughs> it's the Dracula. Carl! <laughs> Carl! <laughs> He's got fangs and everything, but... Just, just, just like the real Carl. Just like um... the real Carl, then. He needs that. <laughs> that means we got to do this. <gasps> oh, God. Oh shit, son. Oh, Don is going on the board. <laughs> and thus. With a busted ass marker. Hang on. Yeah, yeah, I'm noticing that. <laughs> it's because you keep huffing it, Ven. They're delicious. Uh, sharp, oh. Sharpie number two. Don M has taken up the last slot on the fuckwall 2.0, which means, Ven, I guess you got to go down to Grand Toy or Staples or whatever, buy a new piece of Bristol board. The fuck yep. wall. Three. <laughs> point that A3 oh. uh, bit of uh, paper is not cutting it anymore. <laughs> is, that, is that A3 sized? I don't know. Frank, keep your hands to yourself. Don't fall on him. <laughs> Bad Frank. That motherfucker will bite you if you're not careful. Um, I know. I know. He has rabies. Man, fuck wall 3.0, man. That's it's going to be a thing. I kind of want to do glitter, but glitter's not allowed in my house, so I'm going to have to like recruit one of my hippie friends. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> Seal I, I it mean, in you, with you, some uh, hair... E even if you have someone do it outside your house, you're just going to be like walking around the house one day in like your attic or something. Be like, why the fuck is there glitter here? Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> oh, yeah. One thing I do want to mention. Uh, we got we got a t-shirt. T-shirts. Yes. T-shirts, yeah. hoodies, uh, pillow wait, 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 covers. We got, we got a brand new one. Long though. sleeves. Man. Okay. <laughs> one, one time a year, one month, Oregon, every year, the Hail Santa comes out. It is back. Hail Santa. <laughs> it's real. It's beautiful. And I spent way too long in Inkscape doing this stupid what, thing. So what, 15, 20 minutes? <laughs> More like an hour. Um, <laughs> it comes in black. It comes in green. It also comes in pillow, which is... <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, but it doesn't come in body pillow, and that's no. unfortunate. We got the things. Uh, that's over on Teespring site. You can find that at linkscamecast.com. And we don't have like ridiculous. I see people and I know what these shirts cost. And they're like, oh, well, it's only $35. And I'm like, you guys are robbing people. Those are like mm -hmm. 20 bucks. Come on. <laughs> so you have exactly one month to pick that nonsense up. Uh, or you'll a, die. That's right. I did have to rework uh, something I'm trying to simplify with the affiliate links. If you click on that, 
kind of get the idea what's going on here. Like we have a, we can't say we are supported by Amazon in any way because affiliate disclaimer, but however, there are links to things like hamburger ejectors, which are real. Ooh. UKT, <laughs> Canada hockey sticks, Deutschland Bratwurst, and French cheese. So if you click through that, I'm just saying there's a fair warning that it will attach a thing on the end of URL, and we may or may not allegedly receive monetary compensation if you buy something outside of that link. There. Is Indeed. That- All right. <laughs> so, Dancing let, around let, the issue. <laughs> let, let, let us begin with let uh, there be some Lutris. cheese. Some cheese. Let there Fromage. be Lutris and let there be, uh, well, a new version. Uh, the version is not 5.4, and uh, Strider has added support for Python uh, 3.8. Never heard of uh, it. Python 2 for added life, Added some maybe. config validation support for NVIDIA Prime offload, which is very interesting to see. I am still half tempted to buy one of those uh, mining-only cards to see if Prime Offload actually works properly, and I do have El Cheapo to try that kind of stuff on, so stay tuned. Uh, the <laughs> uh, There's also uh, an issue uh, down around the middle of the uh, changelog that says, fixed installation issues uh, for users whose username begins with X. Mm-hmm. So, Strider, what exactly is your issue with username starting with X? I'm pretty sure he just doesn't want XX Bong Slayer 69 XX using Lutris. <laughs> XX Sephiroth 78 XXX. XX Studman <laughs> 69. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah uh, the, the, the other thing that got fixed with this release, though, is uh, Lutris will pick up your Gallium 9 installations oh, for sure. um, your native DX9 goodness. Although, although I will say that may not be necessary for too long, considering D9VK standalone is <laughs> very likely going to be a thing, considering the guy who's working on DXVK standalone. Alone is the guy who writes DX who writes D9VK. Dude, did so, anyone uh, <laughs> like with the D9VK? Did anyone catch a whiff of the uh, that little drama llama that showed up about the one? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah <laughs> man. Yeah, that, like, that, that guy was getting straight up stalked. He, he like straight up yep. was like, "Yo, man, it, it closed like some weird issue." And he's like, "Nah, man, I'm not gonna deal with that." Then the dude just like hundreds of like bullshit and it know, wasn't issue. just his github it was like any github that he participated yeah. on just like stalker started level emailing the dude yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, uh and twitter in their infinite you know finally josh was like yo this dude at replied you know then the dude panicked and like lost his shit as these mm-hmm. little fuck watts do fuck the <laughs> platypus <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, it, it was crazy too because, like, in in the original thread, the guy's like, "Clearly, you don't care enough to like give us information about this bug, so mm-hmm. I'm just gonna close it because you're not helping." And yeah, yeah. <laughs> dude. Uh, anyway, that that was like unnecessary. But hey, we know personally those type of people exist. Yes, yes. some of them have T-shirts <laughs> for faces. It's brilliant. Um, <laughs> that's not the only Lutris. News. No, no, it isn't double get complete. Out, get, out, get out the money, penguin. Get the penguin. Oh, anonymous, you bought a classic tea. Yay. Yeah. Yeah, we we we, we some someone bought a Hail Santa and a and a penguin shirt. Okay, also I didn't me. know that worked. Um brilliant. <laughs> it works. <laughs> yeah. It's so, raining Vizels. That's right, man. Team Sweeney has been awarded the epic. Mega grand. Feel free to clip that out. Um, for the project's tenth birthday, this comes from uh, Fr- uh, Strider Le Pew. He- he's in chat room right now. You can see him. Look at him. He's oh, he's brilliant. <laughs> uh, he-, he got the twenty five thousand wet, stinky caches from that initiative with the Epic Mega Games grant. Da 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 da. Anyway, Frenchy got paid, son. Let's just go ahead and say. Oh yeah. That. And he's going to be able to roll this in and really help out the Lutris project, man. Because I saw that. I was like, yay. We were talking to the pre-pre super show. I was like, even sitting down to those, it just made me happy. I'm like, right on. That gives you the good feels. Yep. Yep. Pedro. This is just good. I mean, it's for Strider, it's great because it's like some money to actually help develop Lutris. Of course, he's going to have to pick up the pace now, but yeah. Uh, also, uh, it's Even also a very, very positive like thing. For like yeah. eight minutes. Uh, it's 
also a very positive thing because that's $25,000 less that Epic gets to spend on buying exclusives. Yeah, so when, when, when you say helping out Strider <laughs> develop Lutris, what that really means is purchasing cannabis, like a lot of cannabis, <laughs> like... So well, he much. does live in California, so there's right, that. right. No, like you, you know, you can buy like those giant, like twenty five pound gummy gummy bears. Like it's gonna be that, but like a cannabis gummy. No, I like you. I, I like the first revision, gunny bears. Um, gunny bears. Gunny bears. bears. It, okay. It's filled with gunpowder and THC. One um, thing I did have to notice online was some of these motherfuckers need to get up out of their mom's basement and kind of learn how the world works. Because I saw on Reddit of all places, imagine. Uh, a post that and I'm paraphrasing but just a little bit that very much along the lines of Lutris should be focused on getting more developers instead of trying to get money to my brain froze. It tapped out. It's like, you didn't just read that. And it's like, I think we just read that. And it's like, Get, try it one more time. It's like, Oh wow. I, I didn't know what to say after that, that um, check it out. Ladies and gentlemen, I love Frenchie. He's the closest thing I have to a IRL nemesis. And um, <laughs> former co-host with one of our shows, LWDW, you might go watch it on Wednesday. But for you end users, you got to look at it like this. Here's what Epic's doing, man. They're spreading around some cash. Some of this cash happened to fall with the Lutris project, and it will absolutely, worst case scenario, help with compatibility with the Epic launcher. That's a yes. good thing. That's a win-win, no matter how much you might not like Timbits, Old Sweeney Sauce. And everyone, everyone, if you're running an open source project, you know what, man? You can imagine, you can think about, like, how much breathing room $25,000 would give you for the project. Like, if we were doing it, had that, come on, Tim, call me. But with Lutris, that's definitely going to help out, and new things will come from that. Yeah, it's like... Even if it was Microsoft, man, hey, man, money, money, put it good use in the bank. Yeah. That's brilliant. Be happy yep. for Strata. Oh, Frenchie, I'm, don't be jelly, okay? You know what? You can be a little jelly. Oh, I'm, I'm absolutely, 100%. <laughs> you, can, you can totally be against, like, where that money come from, came from or what the intent of it is to basically offload Linux support to someone who's actually going to do it. But again, you can also be happy that, you know, Strider's project is being financially compensated and is successful, right? Mm -hmm. Cognitive dissonance is a feature of the human brain that some kind of, sometimes can be leveraged for good. Sometimes. Yep. It yeah, can, the... Man. Uh, I very much am of that opinion because, yeah, Epic, they haven't been doing so well for the Linux stuff, and I kind of hate them for that. But then they drop 25k on Lutris. It's like, yeah, that's pretty cool. It, it, and Mike it, G it doesn't forgive all the other shit that they do, but you can, <laughs> you can do good things and you can do bad things, right? So there you go. This, Congratulations, this, Strider. I hope you don't it, kill all your brain it's cells. It's good, man. It, it's good. So just, just focus on that. It, it's going to be spent well no matter. You know, it's not like it came from Microsoft, people. Okay? Yeah, it just yeah. came from China. Yeah, same difference. Uh, <laughs> ten cent money. <laughs> I got to use... We, we have a little video toaster known as a 2060. That can play Quake 2. Why am I talking about that? Because there was an update to the RTX on version 1.2. Free game. It's kind of weird launching a native Linux game that starts off with Bethesda. Like, in mm. the screen, yeah. like, what? <laughs> That kind of takes you back. <clears throat> However, don't get too excited if you have like a little 2060 with like 0.5 of a tensor core because you're still going to be rocking about 40 FERPs at 1080p. And uh, But for the updates, they've uh, the rendering of glass that's been improved uh, along with the reflections and their options to enable dynamic resolution. Ah, words, English. Re resolution. Right? We're wrong. Dynamic resolution scaling when uh, dynamic scaling is activated, which is a legitimate option. And yeah, it, it still runs it. All right. It still runs it faster than your 1080 Ti. That's the one thing I got on you, man. 14 frames a second, baby. 14 frames a second. Yeah, no, at 720p uh, with everything on low, uh, this 1080 can push 30-ish. <laughs> oh yeah, if, if you if you jack it down to like six six hundred by four eighty or right. whatever, six forty by four eighty. <laughs> yeah, I, I get I get like one hundred and twenty frames a second RDX on. If Woo! I knock it down to seven twenty p, I I can ride that sixty just kind of if I squint hard enough. But I mean, it looks okay. I did the same thing. It's like 
Yeah, okay, that's neat. Uninstalled it. But hey, <laughs> you do have to keep in mind, this is a fully path traced game. This isn't like just fucking around a little bit with some mud puddles, you know? Yeah. No, so, no, no, it's like the and, whole thing. Right. It, it, it looks really good. Like they have the, they, they fixed up a bunch of the reflective surfaces stuff. Like the lighting looks a lot better now. Um, it, and I mean, really, this is just a glorified tech demo. Just be like, hey, we've taken an old game. We added some RTX bits to it. Right. Look, look how good it looks. This and, game from like 2000, what, three or whatever. And it's also a very good example of NVIDIA being like, hey, man, this works with Vulcan people. Yes. We got the shim. Make it happen. Okay, but fine. yeah, the performance oh. is still a bit poop. Oh no, it's great <laughs> if you have a twenty eighty Ti. I mean, yeah. I'm sorry, it's great if you got a yes, 12 buy the twelve hundred dollar yeah, video right. card. Yeah, uh huh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> quick too. I, I I spent mine already, and I can't. Strider, that, so. there you go. There's your first purchase for Lutra. So you need to test that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> go, All go right, Lion four zero three. It's out. It's a maintenance release. According to the high level patch alerts. There's national language support file fixes and other various bug fixes. The thing that stood out for me is, you know, if you're if you're one of the crazy people, you just straight up run Sigwin on Wine. Your your dash binary works. Um, but yeah, there, there's there's a bunch of other fixes for a bunch of games like uh, Chronicles of Mistara. Uh, will properly load the DX11 library. Um, Visual Studio 2017 will install. Uh, Adobe InDesign, Oracle Java, all basically. It's a lot of stuff where you say, why the hell is Wine actually patching the stuff in? And it's for completeness sake, right? Like the entire I'm point of it is to fully like, implement Who the, are the you people? Stuff. Because you're saying things like, oh, wow, what? What is this program to the Googles? I'm like, what? Okay. Yeah. But that's what Wine's good at, isn't it, Jordan? Like maintaining yeah. legacy support for stuff that's not going to run on Windows at some point. Oh, absolutely. It, it is becoming the better Win32 API than, you know, the Windows one. Mm. Slowly but surely. I mean, <laughs> It I get we we've said it before. It's a very, it's a Herculean task, right? They're they're trying to make Windows apps run under Linux, oh, and that's not it's not an easy task that, to begin with. I would not wish that on my worst friend, but yeah, especially when you're shifting one thing, and it's probably going to jack up four things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, Indeed. this is the uh, like Jordan said, it's a maintenance release for the stable version. Uh, this is the 4.0 version, so if you just install Wine with sudo apt install Wine, that's the version that gets pulled down by default. So yeah, if say you're running Wine for the sake of running video games and whatnot, you should be using the development version because- Or, Pro or, or Proton. Yeah, that's, or Proton, yeah. Mm. <laughs> Because, uh, yeah, even Proton is up to Wine 4.11, so that, that's more current. But, or, or, yeah, or it's, you can um, use the Glorious Egg Roll. Or you can give Lutris a try. Hmm. It will do all of that for you. You don't money. even have to worry about it. So, out of the corner of my eye, I read this next story as Hentai Net AI Blaster, but... <laughs> Sorry to I, I, I mean, you, you, you can say that. If you, if you want to blast some hentai, it's the way to do it. No, Hestia, um, named after the Greek goddess of the forge, who sat in the middle of Mount Olympus. I know this because I was a giant nerd as a child. Anyways, um, well, this is, this is a... Uh, that, right? No. Uh, it's, a uh, it's a machine learning assisted tool for um, reviewing Overwatch uh, reports. Overwatch is the system that Valve cleverly named to not confuse people with the Blizzard product, uh, that will essentially go through uh, VAC ban requests, right? Like, if it detects that you're cheating, you'll go through Overwatch, they'll have a process there, and um, yeah, you'll it will be determined whether you get your account locked or not. Um, this one is... Uh, effectively like a basement project right like this person it's a one it's a one man project it's made by some like 14 year old kid who um worked on it in his spare time and uh in reviewing overwatch requests it is able to what was it like uh 98% 98.36% yeah yeah <laughs> ac accurately flag people who are actual cheaters now the, like you might say, oh wow, this is great, but you have to realize that this is the data set that this thing is working off of is people who have already been reported for cheating. So it's not like, oh, mm -hmm. I just run it on the game server and it'll just pick out all the cheaters. No, it'll actually confirm whether or not people are cheating or not. But it's still it's still very impressive, and I'm pretty sure that uh, Valve is going to be so Valve tossed out a uh, bounty to this guy as well for this. Mm. But I'm pretty sure there's going to be some more cash moving in this guy's direction vis-a-vis -vis job offers or <laughs> just like more contract work. Yeah. Yep. 
because yeah, it's like ninety eight point thirty six percent is very good. That's you know better than people good. But yeah, as Jordan said, that this is for those cases that have had enough people report uh, a player for cheating that they go into Overwatch and then their games start to be analyzed by everyone who's on overwatch and they actually look at the footage and see okay all right this person's cheating or this person's not cheating and uh one of the things that i noticed looking at the numbers because they have the cases containing legit users aim assistance visual assistance external assistance or griefing issues it's like you're also uh looking at grievers mm -hmm. really grieve grieve okay <laughs> I don't know, man. Uh, anything that makes getting... Because, you know, it, it's been a long time since I've played anything remotely competitive. But that, that's that been a problem since you connect the two computers to each other. Somebody's yes. just been that jackhole. And um, that can really suck the fun out of a game, like, really quick. So, yeah, what do you feel about, like, automating it, though? I mean, does it get to the point where you just let the AI loose with the banhammer? I mean, I mean that that's that's the question, right? Uh, depend it depends on like how competitive your game is. For some small games, I would say probably not. For something like Dota or Counter Strike, where you know a lot of times there's actual money at stake because there's mm -hmm. a competitive, yeah. there's like a professional league and a professional ladder where people are actually trying to become like better in terms of a skill at this game. So, and it. I mean, it, it defeats the purpose if someone's going to come in with their elite hacksaws. Just be mm. like, ah, oh, I can see you through the walls. <laughs> I just have to, like, move my mouse in the vicinity and it will auto-aim to your head. <laughs> um, yeah, it, it it makes it so that, you know, the people who are actually investing time and effort to make to get good at the game, their effort's entirely invalid. Yeah. Right on, right on. And uh, cheating in Counter-Strike has always been an issue since, you know, cheating in Counter-Strike Counter is just part of the game. Since, since, since the beginning yeah. of Counter-Strike, yeah. pretty yeah. much. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> what do you Linux on? Yeah, Windows. so a uh, fine person uh, behind Boiling Steam uh, decided, you know what, let's do a little bit of a uh, survey to see what kind of distro uh, people are using to basically play their games on and this is the graph that they ended up with and you see ubuntu at the top with 29.8 percent manjaro comes in second place with 17.5 then mint at 11.7 then you have uh arch with a 16.6 debian with 5.6 eat it pop os with 6.9 fedora with 3.3 and uh solus with two so the you know like what? the you know what i'm gonna go ahead and say it because solus Gets to do a victory lap for registering. I mean, I mean, it's right there, right below yep. Fedora. That's pretty significant. <laughs> yeah, I, I Although, mean, Fedora's uh, holding if you that actually average, look uh... at the numbers, go ahead. Yeah, if you actually look at the numbers, you see uh, that 2.5 uh, and 2.3 over the past couple of months, then 2.2, .2, and now it's 2. So it's actually on a bit of a de decline, a decline, which is unfortunate. Decline, yes. <laughs> I, just, I just like that Fedora's been holding on to that, like, roughly 3.5% for the entire time. I think yeah. Fedora's, Fedora, I mean, if we're looking at the graph, man, I mean, the, still the big chungus is the Kumbuntu, followed by Manjaro, followed by Mint. So this is clearly accurate to the easiest distros to use first with Ubuntu, then ben, Manjaro, then to Mint, then to Arch, then to Debian. Hi. Um, <laughs> I I don't think Fedora is harder to use than... No, I, th I think the thing that makes people bounce off it is the fact that you actually have to go out of your way to install the NVIDIA drivers. Yeah. Um, not but really. I, it's, it's, not, it's not difficult, right? Like, it's well, just people it, being money babies. I think it kind uh, of boils down to where, where you started with Linux. Like, the idea of dropping, you know, the terminal and installing the runfuls. Like, that's how we used to have to do it, period, with everything. There was no, yeah. like, alternate way of doing that. Indeed. Oh yeah, and uh, I should mention these numbers were pulled from ProtonDB specifically. Just looking at the reports mm -hmm. on what people yes. are playing. I hope yeah. he made them up. <laughs> yeah, um, but yeah, I mean, I mean, like we we see Ubuntu's market share shrinking because like a lot of other really good distributions have come up and have started targeting its market segment, right? Well, and and Ubuntu hasn't really been making friends with a lot of the decisions they've been making lately with Mir, with System D, and Upstart. To a point, with man, removing 32-bit library support that because it, 
you see the new shiny. I remember when Kabuntu was the new kid on the block and everything was purple and brown for a minute. Then Mint got the new shiny on it. Then that blew up for a minute. Now it's Manjaro and Arch. That's the new shiny. It's got the Polish on it. Uh, honorable mention, Salt has popped up for a second. Then, but yeah, it's, it's, it's just the flavor of the week. Pop, I'll, I'll yeah, I'll, Pop has I'll, actually I'll, been doing pretty good. Pop's doing pretty <laughs> decent. Yeah, I, I will. I will say, I think, I think a large, uh, a large component of Arch and Manjaro's success in general is for AMD card users, right? Because um, a lot of distributions will stagger their releases with Mesa and whatnot. Um, so mm -hmm. you're not necessarily going to get the latest and greatest support if you have an AMD card. Uh, versus something that's more rolling or is a more a little, a little more aggressive with uh, the upstream code, uh, like Arch or Manjaro, uh, you're you're going to start getting that AMD support. You're going to get that ACO support very very quickly and very very timely. And I think that that's uh, that's a very attractive uh, property for especially a lot of people who are coming from Windows and have AMD cards, right? Um, yeah, but you also have to deal with the people of walking out of Windows like right into Arch. Well, I, that that's kind that's kind of I think why Manjaro is. It, expanding in popularity because it's arch but it's the easy arch easy mode gonna make it easy yes <laughs> really <laughs> and you know to be fair to your point jordan uh, ubuntu tends to fall in and out of favor because of the decisions that they make and it happens a lot it tends to happen a lot and right now i think they're actually on the uptick again because with 1910 as it turns out the performance on the default version that comes with gnome is pretty good hmm. So, <laughs> I mean, it works out of the box, man. I mean, if, like, yep. to this day, it's like, what should I install? Do, have you Linuxed how many times? I've not, oh, I've Linuxed zero times. Here, here's Ubuntu. Deal with that. Why? Because you Google something, that's what you're going to find help for. Pretty yep. much. All right. But that, that, but I, I mean, t just as a final point, yeah, but now, now you're seeing a lot more ArchWiki pop up first because it's a good documentation source. Anywho, coming up next. Get your vacuums out, get your mops, and Hide your get kids. your mullet. Hide your wife, hide the bodies. It's time to go back in time and clean some cereal. I like my muesli squeaky clean. That's your pet name for it. All right, fair enough. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, if you would like to participate in the home game, which is suggesting show titles and more importantly, voting on them, head over to vote.linuxgamecast.com. Yeah. IRL Nemesis. Uh-oh. Uh, we got Drama Llama. Jill only put that in there because it's like Nemesis Star Trek. Or Hope she's a big Pedro. Resident Evil 3 fan. Nope. Star Trek. <laughs> I'll get an like XX Bong Slayer 69 a vote. Let's dig. Dig through the ditches and burn. <laughs> oh, come on, Tux Ramos. Uh, this is only my second my beer of the night. Nama. I'm <laughs> pacing myself. It's like I only had one. It was a growler. Wait, mini cake. Deal with it. <laughs> Gunny bears. Gunny like bears. <laughs> Jar of nuts. <laughs> nuts are expensive, yo. <laughs> yes, yes, they are. <laughs> Especially at the rate that I eat them. Damn. I mean, you're just double fisting nuts. I straight up do. Like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Basil, thank you. I, I thought that Growler was a bit of a different thing here, but. Yeah. Mm -mm. <laughs> yeah. When, when, when Australia, I Australia say growler, they'll know what you mean. <laughs> oh, it's a thing here too. Oh, I know. But it's a thing here too. <laughs> but it comes out of your butt. Yeah, if you have a growler coming out of your butt, you need. Uh... You need to eat you either need more to see or less someone. fiber. <laughs> Sunflower seeds are only good if they have the shells on them, because I was like, man, life hack. I'm going to get some sunflower <laughs> seeds without the shells on them. Rubbish. It's like, it's no fun. There's no point to these things. It's like it's like pre-shelled pistachios, right? Like Yeah, right? You, you got to have like that chunk it around it, in your mouth feel. Like, 
Well, like, that, 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 that's my argument for, like, um, the whole Doritos experience thing, right? Like, because there's a food experience thing. You would not buy pre-shelled pistachios. You would not <laughs> buy pre-shelled sunflower seeds. like buying pre-shelled hot dogs. No, don't. I think that's that's just ground beef. <laughs> I don't think there's a lot of beef in a hot dog, dude. Unless it says it's I'm, beef and it costs, like, be eight quid quotes. more. Okay, in there quotes. we go. All right. Like cow uh, tusks. Yes. <laughs> hey, you're not the regular rat feces guy. <laughs> I always see like the um, in the meat section. They have like sausage, and it'll be two fifty. Then the exact same packaging and everything, except this one says like one hundred percent, and it's like five quid more. And this is like real beef <laughs> sausage. And I'm like, that raises questions because that's the you, same you, weight, man. You usually, if I go to if I go by sausage, I'm going to the butcher where they have like actual sausage. Sorceress, how can you tell the difference then? <laughs> it's just cartilage. Most of it is just cartilage. Ben, Ben's <laughs> hair is plastic. It's true. Yeah. Every, every every morning we get that we get a scene when Ven wakes up. It's like uh, Darth Vader when he gets introduced in the Empire Strikes Back, where you just have like the back face Ven's back facing you, and the hair gets lowered down on his head, That's and he just spins around. <laughs> All right. Force choke someone. Piss. I'll be back. Have you ever thought about cutting your hair? Oh yeah, I have. I'm thinking about like getting it like shoulder length. So my 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 deal is, I'm expecting it to fall out in a couple of years. Mm -hmm. So it's more of a let's let's enjoy it while I have it, right? Because like once once it starts going. Like once once I start getting like visibly bald, I'm not gonna like keep the horseshoe. I'm just gonna Walter White it. I could feel that. Yeah, I mean honestly, I wouldn't be against shaving my head, but I'm just like, why? I don't know. I don't know. I I think I have a I weird get a shaved big head. Ass head so though, dude. yeah, like my. Like my, my my head is like very very round, so I'm not sure I could rock the bald look. But like, if I don't, I'm not gonna do a comb over. That's just no one would want to buy my head. I want to buy your head, make a puppet out of it. Biohacked, free to ever go bald. Ah, uh, the innocence of youth, Nova. Do a pixie cut? You mean a mullet? No, pixie cut is just short, all around. No, I don't know. It's it's, it's like a it's like a little long in the front. Yeah, that's gotta go. I don't know. It doesn't make a difference to me one way or the other. It just it just seems like it'd be easier to manage if it was shoulder length. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Um. Like it, I because I have like super curly hair, right? So it's it's right. a whole thing to maintain it. Um, well, I have like super fine hair. I refrain from saying thin hair because that's not true. I have a shitload of hair. It's just very thin. Yeah, like the the individual hairs themselves like are Angel thin. And, not I, not 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 the coverage is thin. I have two yeah. looks. I have two looks. I have like straight out of the shower, where it's just because it's so fucking fine, or. If I comb it back with any type of like mousse or anything like that, it looks like I have a mob. So no, Nova, Nova, I will prove you wrong. Okay. When I show up for scale this year, All right? Because it's humid in California, mm -hmm. and I go poof. I straight up look like Sideshow Bob, and then I step on a rake, and then I sound like Sideshow Bob. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nobody who spoke German has done anything bad. Hmm. There, that that's Jordan with humidity. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> yeah, it is. You want you, you, you want you want a poodle. That, no, that's more what that it looks is, like. Uh, uh You crawl into suitcases every time it gets over the certain barometric pressure, man. Right in a suitcase every time. Mm. What kind of big ass suitcase do you think I have? It's the kind you aspire to have, man. It's a little one now. Suitcase goals? Yeah. Real issues. 
Well, you shouldn't watch people when they sleep, Jill. A. Um, <laughs> just throwing that out there, friendly or, advice. You know, she's, just, she's just upset that she had to be Big Spoon. Mm. I don't know. I mean, I genuinely never do anything with my hair except get up and tie it up. I had a girlfriend who liked to put it in pigtails. Was it her that liked it in pigtails? I mean, I it, it can be mutually beneficial. I'm just saying. No, I'm not going to pigtail shame. Sometimes you just got to spice if stuff I'm sitting up. around with Nori, she starts braiding my hair. Actually, I actually really like it when people, like, scratch my head, so... Because I'm secret, because I'm secretly a poodle. That, that's my, that's my, that's my secret shame. I'm a poodle. There's not enough coin on this earth for me to scratch your head, like with my hands. Can I use hooks? Sure, but you have to cut off your hands. Well, I mean, if I'd used my hands, I'd cut them off anyway. So it's win-win. Yeah, all right. Linux hairstyle. Yeah. Grooming tips from a penguin. Yes. Oh, Pedro, what did you name that file again this week? The same as last week. No, you didn't. File.txt. <laughs> it's game.mp4.m4v, right? <laughs> why, don't, why don't you go check that, buddy? I thought I changed the name. Uh, yeah, you did. <sighs> yeah, it is. I know that said, yeah, you did. <laughs> was you asked me to go check. I went to check. I, I, I was about to say, I'm just fucking with you till I realized that you were doing it. <laughs> You said that that was the name don't, that stuck, so now it was going to be that. So I was like, all right, fine, let, I'll keep it. <laughs> I'm not... I was like, no, just, this is going to happen. Let it happen. <laughs> Look, I don't question these things. I just do as I'm asked. <laughs> I have no control. Hmm. Well, Pennywise, you'll have to find out. For those of you just tuning in, or for those of you who've just been watching for the first time, spoiler, we're cult. Um... <laughs> George is a little special, but we're still a cult. Um, <laughs> That's public domain. Please don't take us down, Twitch. <laughs> it better fucking be public domain. Jordan's real name is Greg. Yeah, old Greg. Mm -hmm. I drink barely from a shoe. I, I also gave George Clinton his funk powers. Don't try to stop him. That's how you get bit. <laughs> He'll get bit anyways. Well, fair, fair. All right. We be ready to go. Yes. Did your arm track five? Not for this. <laughs> it's for the um, hey, no. last bit. Yeah. <laughs> Outro music. But did you know track five? <laughs> did you arm track five? <laughs> and don't uh, don't mute Jordan when you arm track five. <laughs>
Well, you got to give him credit, man, because you know when I when I tapped that <laughs> button, man, he just powered through it. When we when he came back <laughs> mid sentence, he's like, "Wow." <laughs> Yeah. Strider, you have a pupper. <laughs> well, RIP 25 grand. Um Who does looks, Strider look like in that picture? <laughs> he Dude. He's 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 been turning into like He has. What what's what's her name? The fucking ancient one from Doctor Strange, Tilda Swinton. He is slowly well, morphing <laughs> into my buddy's wife. It, yeah, he's Slowly turning into Til the Swinton. I don't. I don't know what's up with that. Maybe, maybe maybe he'll get magic powers one day. I don't know. All right, locked in. Also, also, that dog look like looks like it's on crack. <laughs> <laughs> Seems legit. Let's do it in three, two, and maybe, maybe, maybe. Nope, nope, nope. There we go. Bam. And welcome back to the chair acquisition botches and all where the accused wait, must survive wait, trial. Wait, but no, no, uh, no, 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 no. Boop. <laughs> Take two. <laughs> Take, Take two. twelve. For some reason we've lost audio coming in. Yeah, no, it's still coming yeah. in. Huh. All right. Weird. Weird. Are, 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 are we are we back to the chairquisition? Yeah, we're working on it. Give me a minute. All right, all right. And the hobbits, 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 the hobbits. All right. Take two point five in three, two. Assuming there are no more technical difficulties, welcome back you to the position. You shall not record. I, <laughs> I mean, we shouldn't stream this anyways. The accused must survive trial from Fedora, Neon, and Debian. Debian. Uh, this week we're taking a look at Serial Cleaner by Draw Distance, done in Unity. You can pick it up for, well, right now you can pick it up for like three mm -hmm. bucks, but... Um, yep. <laughs> if you miss it, you can pick it up normally for about 15 bucks US. What is it? Slip on your flares, grab your shades, and hop on your station wagon. It's time to work as a mob professional cleaner. A good cleaner never gets caught, so you have to make sure you get in, clean up, and get out without leaving a trace of evidence in this stylish, award-winning 2D action stealth game. Uh, Humble was giving this away if you got the Humble monthly. I paid $4 for it, but it's cool. Um, yeah, let, let's let's start. How how did it run on Debois? Debois? Man, uh, I didn't have any issues with it. Uh, it's Unity Joint, so you normally these days, especially in 2019, don't expect that. And that's on Debian 10, man, with the 1920X Threadripper 2060 GPU, 32 gigajoules of RAM. All that hotness with some NVMe goodness. So performance-wise, 1080, solid 60 FIRPS, 2160. That's what I ran it at, solid 60 and uh, graphics, they work. They're groovy. Was groovy a thing in the 70s? It is now. Yes. Um, controls. X-Clone, out of the box. PS4, out of the box. No complaints. Uh, yeah, man, right on, right on. I'll give it a solid clean bill of health. Coming in with four chairs. I know daddy is not a thing, so I'm not going to say daddy -o. daddy -o. Yeah, on uh, Fedora 30, 64-bit with the i7-6700K with the hyper-threading turned on and the spectre... Hyper-threading on and spectre mitigations on. Smector. Smector, man. That's about, <laughs> that's about as much as it'll protect you. Smector amount. Um, does, does it launch? Yes. Uh, I guess there's a 1080 Ti plugged in there, too. Um... Performance at 1080p. I didn't have to play it at 1080p because at 2160p, it just worked at 60 frames a second because this game is not particularly graphically demanding. It's just Dust Force Men, all featureless and functional. That has no power in Unity and Linux. <laughs> yeah, it's true. But no no issues either way. Uh, and control-wise, I was using the uh, DualShock. Works fine. You get the Xbox prompts, but, you know, whatever. At this at this point, I think I've been conditioned well enough that when I see X, I realize it actually means square, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, so, four chairs. Yeah, and over here in uh, KDE Neon with a 3700X and a GTX 1080, oh, it launches just fine. Uh, the performance, it's a good thing that Unity Games uh, actually figured out how to uh, V-Sync bra. 
and they actually make use of the 144 hertz of my 1440p monitor so that works very very well uh graphics yeah you can look at it no issues whatsoever and the controls yeah the dualshock 4 worked out of the box with the xbox prompts as jordan mentioned but yeah it's clean bill of health as far as i'm concerned four chairs okay so there you go serial cleaner works oh Let's man it's a joint. serial masterpiece of working it's, good they're, they're they're after me lucky charms all right did you have fun with it then <laughs> dude um as a professionally professional game critic allow me to be the first of the group to say fuck stealth games seriously <laughs> Um, the only thing remotely resembling a stealth game that I personally have ever enjoyed in the history of ever is Middle Earth, the series, the two of them. Because, let's face it, that's kind of a stealth game at the beginning, because if you fuck with anything, you die. Um, but then, focus on the positive, they say. Okay, fine. Well, check it out. It is genuinely hard not to dig the art style and the soundtrack of this game. It is 100% the business, man. I like the look of it. It's well done. It's a style choice. It is not lazy at all. It's groovy, baby. Um, soundtrack's decent. Not a problem there. Runs at a solid 60 FERPs, even in UHD at 2160. And the controls, hey, man, they work well enough. I didn't have any complaints. I saw some people complaining like, oh, they're a little glitchy at something. Man, I never ran into any of that. It yeah, for fuck's sakes. Listen, man, I, I kind of feel like someone just asked me to try to come up with, like, some good things to say about Hitler, man. And, <laughs> you know, listen, I'm not comparing Serial Cleaner the Game to one of the worst people of the 20th century. Only this genre that is stealth. Seriously. Stealth games, literally Hitler. Um, What do you think I'm going to give it <laughs> <laughs> Any guesses? I'm three. Uh, yeah, three. yeah. I want to. <laughs> I can count to three. Three. Um. Yeah. I mean, the stealth mechanic here kind of reminds me of Metal Gear Two: Solid Snake. Every enemies have like a cone of vision, and sometimes they can hear you, and you dip and dodge your way through. And in this case, through means some giant fucking level sometimes that you need to haul bodies and speed vacuum blood out of. Um. So, I, I mean, like, stealth games aren't usually my cup of tea either, but I gotta say, it is it is kind of thrilling at times when, like, you got a bunch of dudes looking for you, and you're, like, right in the exact dead zone of, like, three people's vision cones, and they don't see you, and you're like, <laughs> fuck yes, fuck yes, I am the ghost, I am the knight. Then they snap um, around, you're like, fuck. But, I mean, my, 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 my main problem with the game is just, like, how much waiting is involved, right? Like, mm -hmm. that, that part's not fun to me, because you, like, you're in a trash can or behind some oils or in a canoe, and you're using your, like, omniscient god vision mode to watch the idiot pigs bumble around <laughs> their jobs trying to catch you. Um, the soundtrack's pretty good, although I will say there's some stuff in there that's, like, a little plagiarism-esque for my taste. Oh. Like, yeah... Someone's going to sue someone. This sounds a little too familiar to some existing stuff. Um, it's all right. Um, I put about an hour into it, and it, it's just one of those things where, like, my frustration towards the genre and the way the game mechanics work stop me from really enjoying it. There are individual moments that I can point to and say, this part is really fun, but it's hard to reproduce. Um, I'll give it two chairs. It's all right. If stealth games are your jam, this one's a pretty decent one. But if it's not, it's not going to change your mind about the genre if you believe it's literally Stalin. Yeah. And it's really not often you see a stealth game which doesn't rely on darkness for, well, everything. Uh, because, yeah, that's usually what stealth, uh, stealth games do. But Serial Cleaner is, in fact, very bright and very colorful. Look at it. Uh, and yeah, like Jordan said, it doesn't really change your opinion when it comes to stealth games. Yeah, and I'm still opinion. very Stupid much goose stepping game. Yeah, <laughs> now I'm still very much meh on the whole stealth genre. Uh, Thief 2 The Metal Age was the one stealth game up to this point that I actually really, really enjoyed. Uh, though, to be fair, that game did rely on darkness a lot. Uh, but this one is completely different to that, and while it is very well done, I will recognize that it is very well done, it doesn't really 
tickle my fancy. I did enjoy the lighthearted humor for what is a game about covering up uh, the evidence of some very, very <laughs> gruesome crimes. Uh, you mean but vacuuming up blood. Yep. <laughs> blood vacuum. LOL, JK. Uh, not really. Yeah, it's uh, the lightheartedness and the humor the, about the whole situation is very well done. But I kind of didn't want to play anymore after I got to the disco level that there's like eight cops running around <laughs> and you have to get three bodies uh, to the body drop point. It's like, um, I, I don't want to play this game anymore. I really don't. So for, yeah, for, the fun for, for was, me was the for me, it was the campsite where it's just like, oh, there's like a yeah. cop right in there and you got to like dip and juke. I'm, I, I don't care enough. Yeah, I really didn't see the fun. It, it was not there for me. So I'll give it one chair. Just well, not my right. bag. Here's well, there, uh, outside of the, the, the llama is not the only vampire because apparently you have a Dyson vampire uh, that you're armed with, which I, I thought was kind of interesting. <laughs> Uh, you, you do vacuum blood a lot in this game. But, Jordan, especially like in the Forester, the game itself, I think, if it wasn't for the stealth, wouldn't piss me off. A good strat for the forest is like fuck with the cops and get them to chase you, hide, then just go YOLO. Oh, ab absolutely. There a, lot, a good deal of this is like, unlike other stealth games where like if you hide, there's a chance that uh, mm. the people will find you. If you make it to one of the safe zones, that's it. You're good. You're safe. Good. So there's... Yep. I, I found myself cheesing that quite a bit by just like doing, I, essentially resetting the level because it, it places the stuff you need to pick up in a random location every time you restart the level. So sometimes you can game that and like get stuff that's all really, really close to hidey holes and then just do it, just jump to the hidey hole, do the thing, jump back, wait, do the thing, jump back. Yeah, you trap the cop too. That's pretty good. I, there's I like only so much that. you can do with the mechanics with this, and they missed an opportunity again to like have called it Vacula and put a cape on it. I'm just saying. Yeah, I'm I, I, I mean, may, may, maybe that's some DLC, right? Where you gotta like collect blood for a vampire. Anyways, if you like stealth games, maybe you'll enjoy this one. If not, then you still probably won't enjoy it. Coming up next, we're gonna we're gonna put our hands at ten and two, put the pedal to the metal, and talk about driving wheels because we're all experts on that. Yeah. Maybe not. I had one in the nineties, early noughties. <laughs> Man, every time I do that, my brain just kind of like flashes back to Piccolo when he takes off his turban and like cape thing. Mm. <laughs> I, I want to get it, I want to get it as smooth as that. <laughs> Be like, I'm, wear I'm wearing weighted training clothes. Uh, uh. Man, isn't it strange when you catch a DBZ clip that's not voiced by the DBZ abridged crew and you're like, that sounds wrong. Yeah. They're, they're, <laughs> that's they're, why they're, I watch it in Japanese. <laughs> especially with Goku. I, th I think, like, Lanny does a decent enough Sabbath imp Sabbath impression that um, it's, pr it's pretty close. Uh, but, yeah. Goku especially. I'm yeah, all purple and is horny. She ear just piercing hate in this. Japanese. <laughs> all right. I, I, it's, it's, it's been like the same lady who was voicing him since Dragon Ball. And I, I guess I kind of understand why they kept the same actor, but I still hate it. <laughs> oh man, we got a tie at vote.lenoxiencast.com. IRL Nemesis <laughs> and Goonie Bears. Oh, Rise of the Mental Apes. Rise of the Mental Apes. <laughs> Drama Llama. I'll, I'll, I'll give Draggy Llama a vote too. Oh, one Pedro action. Yeah, let's make that complicated. <laughs> <laughs> Tie it up even more. Yep. <laughs> yep. Support our nuts. Artichoke clicker. I was I was kind of sad no one no one banks just said plage esque. <laughs> hey man, I got one for Vacula. Nice. I think Don did that. It's the Univacula. Because it's the 70s, right? Old Sweeney sauce. Actually, we more banana. What do you think Sweeney sauce tastes like? Happiness and money. Tastes like it tastes like about twenty five thousand dollars. Just like I'm, I'm just okay. Oh, oh, you said something mean about me. I'm gonna go cry on my money. Yeah. Yep. Dry those tears. Mm. 
Is there any like ugly sweaters that catch your fancy? I can't wear them. I just get. I I will straight up overheat. Well, if you cut the heat down in the house, there, there's. It's already off. Like your heat's off. Yeah. I run very very hot. I do too, but I mean, it's fifteen degrees outside. It's not cold. Also, the it's what do you minus call it, the... two outside. What was it? Temperature <laughs> Toronto. It is minus one. <laughs> That's chilly. Yeah, earlier um, this morning it was like minus three. <laughs> yeah, we're doing the thing right now where the temperature's like LOL joke because it's been getting up to like 20, but I think later this week it's going to be like two. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm going to try to make some time to wash the cars tomorrow. For their winter bath. So, I, I've, I have a suggestion for Linda. Just write Screw Flanders uh, 700 times. No! <laughs> that, that's an easy way to get 1,400 words. What about Flan? Oh, no, that, that's, that's one of my favorite Simpsons bit, where it's like... There are a bunch of spelling and grammatical errors. You make numerous threats to the UN. <laughs> and the last 300 words are just screw Flanders over and over again. <laughs> you use made up words like Paschetti and Momatos. <laughs> That's like typing without spiel check. <laughs> Man, copying and pasting with... Uh... Into Google Docs is always an adventure because sometimes Control V works, sometimes it doesn't, and sometimes you're just like, all right, middle mouse click. But you're going in one way or the other, man. Control Shift I've, V. Uh, yeah, Control Shift V. That's like my default go to nowadays because it's like, I don't want any formatting. Control Shift V. Nah, done. <laughs> like, I, so I've, I've had some adventures in document editing for the past couple weeks. I had to fill out like an intake form, mm -hmm. um, and they send it to me as like a doc format. And so. Google Google Drive just completely butchered the formatting. Um, pages in OS X fucked it up too. Open Office or LibreOffice was about the only thing that got close enough. Um, Free Office also, apparently also, that um, does very well with the uh, MS Office compatibility. <laughs> uh, the the other one was like form fillable PDFs. There's not a lot of good options under Linux for it. Like um, the font the font scaling options and events for filling up PDF forms is garbage mm. um yeah master pdf editor if you can find the version 4 that was the last actually free one mm. that works the, the the other one too is you can just use zernal but it doesn't do forms you can just write on top of pdfs and save a new one yeah that's usually mm. what i do when i need to like put in a like a signature or something oh yeah i mean one one good thing i'm good to say about chrome is having that built-in pdf viewer so, the, kids don't remember do the forms, dark though? days. I don't know. I don't think it does forms, but I don't. I don't think it does either. The fact uh, of just being actually, able to... if you try to load a PDF with forms, it gives you a, a please wait page, uh -huh. and doesn't load the PDF file at all. Oh, you tease! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> please wait. Please applaud. PDFs are one of those strange vestal vestial uh, things. vestigial vestigial words. <laughs> I was working my way through it. It was about three hundred years off. I don't. I don't know. Cause like when I when I submit resumes to companies, I send them in a PDF format. And then when yeah. someone says like, I I, th I think it's good for static documents. But then you you get people who are like, uh, can you send this as a Microsoft Word document? Like, no. If you can't figure out how to open up a PDF file, I don't want to work for you. There were so many, like, Linux offers uh, that I applied to. It's like, you need to send your uh, CV as a doc. It's like, <laughs> well, I can understand that because it's not the IT department that's writing it. It's the mm -hmm. HR department that's writing it, and they use Word. Oh, hard mode on it, man. Send it as write. Send it as an RTF. Yeah. 
It's like you, you got, text. Woohoo! <laughs> I, 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 I still think uh, LibreOffice can export to like Corel Word Perfect, right? Corel Word Perfect's still a thing, too. You can still buy it. It really? Yeah, that shipped on like the Red Hat Captive Six audience. CDs, <laughs> like the bonus. I remember getting that. I was like, the future is here. And again, this was the mid '90s, kids. So, yeah, like Corel Office is still a thing. I'm like, huh? Java, baby. Java was Java. the future for like 20 seconds, and I mean, it, it's still pretty widespread in enterprise. Oh, really? You say used to. Do you finally end the pain? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think anybody actively. There it is. Free trial. Ooh, there we go. That's what we need to do. We need to do a review. Now, okay. <laughs> $330 for text editor. Yeah. So I, I, I had this conversation with someone, though. They're like, man, I don't want to have to, like install word i'm like google docs google mm -hmm. docs <laughs> yeah <laughs> I, don't, I don't use like i very rarely the only time i use a traditional word processor is to do the show notes because i got to export it to odf or whatever do the formatting so yeah. i can drop it into wordpress so that i can <laughs> reformat it but it will preserve enough of the formatting that i don't have to redo everything because right. the editing tools in LibreOffice are better than the ones in word in wordpress oh dude well <laughs> I'm just glad WordPress finally bent back because they, they were pushing for like code blocks. Mm. Yeah, that, that editing system. I don't know if they called it word blocks or code yeah, blocks. Yeah, that, 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 like, I, I remember when you swapped over to that very briefly, mm -hmm. and I'm like, what the fuck is this? That like, was, none of the formatting is preserved. That, that's how it ships out of the box. But that, when it, they went to that version, everyone's like, what the hell? And then they finally released like the classic editor as an option. So I was able to roll it back. Yeah, kind of necessary, you know, to like work yeah. with, with, with the product. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> you, you joke about that tux, but it's, it's, it's the Googs. They killed, uh, what was the uh, the cloud print? Yeah. Yep. Like you could buy printers. Like I knew people, they're like, yeah, make sure it's got cloud print. I'm like womp womp. Yeah, and there um, were a bunch of printers that were like, you want to do any kind of network printing? Cloud mm -hmm. print is the only thing that it'll do. And now those people are fucked. <laughs> Easy print from your Android device. Cloud print. Stadia is going to last forever, though, you guys. Months. Uh huh. <laughs> forever. Especially ever, after forever, ever. the publicity that it's currently getting. Uh -huh. Dude, uh, <laughs> some from a popular game studio, I, I saw a headline. It was like they've left to form the first studio solely for Stadia. Like, ooh, brave. <laughs> brave, brave. <laughs> <laughs> That's some people looking to retire. They just want to go out. Easy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Especially like Stadia's throwing developers under the bus. They're like, well, it's not our fault that it's not 4K60. It's the developer's fault because they didn't enable. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Look, uh, we've been throwing developers under the bus for a long time because they can't be asked to figure Linux out. So this is nothing new, <laughs> to be fair. <laughs> hey, man, you got to go all the way down to the Linux store by the Linux computer. <laughs> So, yeah, the developers didn't want to do Linux for, you know, proper Linux. And now this like, oh, but Google's throwing money at Linux. So just make a Linux version for that. It's like, oh, what's that? You can't get your game to run properly at fucking 1080p. Nope. You have to upscale 900p to, to 4K. They're like, listen, man, <laughs> it launches in a VM. Ship it. <laughs> I mean, that's basically what Stadia is. Watch <sighs> a fucking VM with a GPU attached to it. Android's great. <laughs> Oculus got bought by Facebook. <laughs> they have enough money to not care. <laughs> uh, Facebook just bought the company behind Beat Saber. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. A lot of people were angry about that. I've never played it. I've watched people play it. It's like, that looks like something I've found with like 
four, possibly six minutes. And... <laughs> Dave actually has one of the, like, third-party um, head-mounted displays, and mm -hmm. he says that Beat Saber is very good. See, Cor my problem Cor with that the, uh... is I would definitely have it set up in a room, then be like, all right, for real, start throwing shit at me. I want to make this interesting. So okay, okay, so one interesting thing I, I I can remark about playing about playing super hot in VR mm -hmm. is that it actually encourages you to kind of like crawl around on the ground. <laughs> I was watching my friend play it, and he's like beat the entire game in VR um, under Linux via Proton, actually. Um, mm. But um, yeah, like his his strategy is basically like get as low as possible like on it crawling around on his hands and knees cuz that's the best way to like duck shit you're saying cheesing the game requires some elbow pads yeah <laughs> it's pretty good uh, i mean like i almost busted his tv playing gorn so oh, no. i mean <laughs> Best thing about VR was all the gifts of people leaning on tables that weren't there IRL. It's like, oh, there's a table in the game. I'm going to lean on it and smack. <laughs> also, nobody I know in Meat Space, even the super sweet ones, would I be like in the same room with a VR headset? Because chances are they owe me one. <laughs> Where they could just wreck me and I'd be like, ah, all right. Yeah, I deserve that one. I remember. I, okay. Cashing that check. <laughs> All right. Let's do it. Let's do it. Hit mail. Hit mail. Done and done. Hat mail. Coming to you Can live. I? In three, two. And it's the end of the show. Wouldn't you know it? Yep. I and can tell my got... forehead's itching. Yeah, it's been another hour or so of uh, Linux gaming-fueled madness, and uh, it's... Well, it's about time to put a bow on it. So if you'd like to help us put a bow on it for next week, you can go to LinuxGameCast.com, hit the contact button, and fill out the form. The uh, teeny tiny little show box even defaults to LGC Weekly, which is exactly where you should be sending your hate mail. You can also send some feedback for LWDW, or, of course, you can ask Jordan for relationship advice. If... For some reason, you're a game developer, and after watching this, you decided, oh, yeah, let's send those guys some keys. Make sure you send at least three. All hey, right. If cool. you're listening, because I know you're listening, most of you are listening, I want you to keep in mind, there's a nice big warning. If you're going to do a copy and paste from a press release, which is fine, you know, because, hey, man, you don't have time to tailor an individual message to us, and you're going to be throwing some keys in there. Send that to show at linuxgamecast.com, as listed on the page don't eventually get tired then finally be like i can't get through your spam golem like it, <laughs> it, it tells you that you can uh, on, on, reading is hard it very 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 <laughs> it is very hard. much <laughs> different all right well the, fir the first hate mail, hate mail. our first and only comes from lalo 1975 they say, thanks a lot for talk about new LG4FF. Thanks to it, I can feel FFB on ETS2, ATS, and lots of car... Uh, uh, that's Sims, not an SMS. <laughs> with, wine yes. proto, with wine slash proto. <laughs> yes. Indeed. Did you get enough acronyms in there for you, Jordan? I don't know, man. IDK, BRB. <laughs> DIF. <laughs> LOL, JK, BBQ. But yeah, you know... All things considered, kudos, uh, Lilo 1975, because that is exactly what I asked for last week. It's uh, if you have a steering wheel on Linux and you haven't had the, well, the force feedback working, it's good to see that uh, new LG4 FF is actually working properly. That's that's very Ooh, nice to see. Now, now that we're thinking about this, but I, I really want to like uh, next week, like a legitimate like motherfucker. I spilt my Starbucks everywhere. Um, 
<laughs> I mean, I can just spell Starbucks everywhere. I can no longer Let's have children. Go but. back to the pre pre super shows and if you'd like to have some sort of context on that. So how was that? Like, <laughs> okay, so with Proton, it was working previously, and then it stopped working. But this is like enhanced, yeah, right? With Proton, yeah, yeah. The, with Proton, the, the, it was the, working because it was just SDL doing everything mm -hmm. as usual. Uh, but yeah, the the Linux native games, a lot of them that did have force feedback support, like Euro Truck Simulator Two and American Truck Simulator, they had. Oh, that's uh, what those stand uh, for. Force, okay. Yes, <laughs> uh, force feedback support mm. on Windows, but not Linux. So now, if you're using LG4FF, it works. Yay, kernel modules. That's kind of brilliant. Also, yep. Lilo 1975, <laughs> I appreciate your efficiency to the point of, I think Jordan and I were like, the fuck does this say? Um, yeah, force feedback on Euro Truck Simulator 2 and American ETS Truck Simulator 2. See, I would have. <laughs> all right. Please, please like, someone seriously, for... All right, fair enough, Jordan. Would you have ever gotten ets2 i don't know if i would have gotten that. May, may, maybe if i if i spend enough time on it though i will i will I say for, for, for next week for next week <laughs> someone please send us a hate mail that's just entirely communicated in emoji hey jordan <laughs> jordan what go fuck yourself no <laughs> all right actually you know what yes i will on that bombshell, let's cue the music. You can always find us around 8.30 Eastern Standard Time. If you're one of our beautiful party patrons, come hang out. Uh, we do the live video and audio for Death Notes and a Bath starting an hour beforehand. Come say hi. Some thoughts, hints, and allegations. Get in touch with old man me, at Vin Stone, on Twitter, or just at Vin on mast.leticsgamecast.com. I'm also on that Wikipedia social media thing, but I don't remember what the URL for the thing is. <laughs> oh boy, am I gonna regret this? But you know what? You should send me your favorite emoji on Twitter at the Burning Fool, <laughs> to me or at Mastodon at the MastodonScapeCast.com. I'm Frojo. It's going to be a lot of eggplants and poop. Like but I hey. said, I'm gonna regret it. <laughs> nope, just straight dick pics, baby. <laughs> Yeah, uh, if you want to follow Richard me on Nixon. Twitter, I'd very much appreciate that. It's at an account at four F O U R because already there was already someone with the number four at the end. Because okay, at some yeah, point you just had to start rolling with it because there had to have been one thing where you were the first. Uh, it was. It was uh, Need for Speed World. <laughs> That's the game that, that uh, Electronic <laughs> Arts killed. Yeah, <laughs> that was the one that made me create unaccounted four with the number four at the end. <laughs> one, one day we're going to meet unaccounted six and then we can finally ditch you. Oh, shit. Credits. <laughs> what, whatever happened to unaccounted five, I wonder. He did. I killed him. <laughs> Dissolved him in acid. Old acid wash Mateus. <laughs> it's like uh, regular so that's Pedro, how the clones ended up. Acid. All right. Indeed. All right. Thanks. Come think of Patreons like Artheron and his like... Fox Dog and Hempty Atomic Ass, Mike Mick G, Barbara Ramp, Dalbios, Haplo, Makik, and Scoot. We got Go for it, baby. We, we got so many producers. So it many is. of them like Jupiter it's Broadcasting good. and Lutris. Nick. Hey, he's got 25 grand that he can spend Time on us 25 now. grand. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yabo. Luke Brad W. Mastoni. Patargo. Mastoni. The Rinnaker. Nicole. Winter Cell. Gonzo. Right. 2000. Dirty D. Sorcerer. Chad. Ruben N. Nova. Nova Harker. Latest and greatest. <laughs> Nova King. Damn it. Now I've got to take a new picture of Freak. He's yeah. going to cut me. Fuck walls Nova full, King. baby. Nova Fuck walls King. full. We have no more fucks to give. Dance. Dance, you bitey <laughs> fucker. Dance. Thanks to Don. Don, we have. Don has consumed our last fuck. Oh. Jeez, yes. fuck all three. <laughs> now Don has taken glitter. our fuck. Fuck, maybe, fuck I, all maybe, three, revenge of the maybe fuck. Maybe I can get something like take a picture of glitter then have that like put on. <laughs> yeah, just take a picture of a pile of glitter and glue it on the board. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> dude. Bad if I ever will. We'll see you next week. Bye. Ah. Uh, it's over. It feels like a blockage in my kidney has been removed. It's because your By kidneys are full of inserting a fiberglass raw and up my urethra and fishing it out. Mm. <laughs> Hot. Oh no, that's what that's what we need. You gotta put like a TV on on the wish zone, <laughs> and then just like <laughs> make 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 our our dynamic programmable fuck wall. <laughs>
We've already had this discussion last week. <laughs> I know, and it's a good idea. No, it's not. <laughs> it's the worst idea, which makes it the best idea. Like, for a minute, I thought about doing an LED scroll. I was like, nope. <laughs> oh, yeah, Tesco's has uh, 4K smart TVs for, like, 200 pounds. And mm -hmm. I went in there today. It's like, oh, that's... I could afford that. Nope. <laughs> you see... This, this I can get away with. If I got like... <laughs> fucking, no. No, 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 no. We, we, listen, we, we've already determined that we're not responsible enough for a chroma key. <laughs> uh, I really might just send you one. There's some green pain. <laughs> Dip all of those uh, acoustic tiles in this particular shit of green. No, no, just one of them, so I can do like, uh, what's his name, <laughs> Jombie from Pee Wee's? Howdy ho! Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Like. Or who was the genie? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, John Jombie was the Jombie. Genie. Yeah, right. Lekka, lekka, hi, lekka. I don't, I don't know. I never watched Pee Wee's Playhouse as a child. I didn't, but I went back and I watched. Just like, wait a minute, Morpheus was it? What? Why? All right. Uh, oh yeah, like uh, Morgan Freeman got to start on the Electric Company, like Vincent the Vegetable Vampire. <laughs> I very much approve of where the conversation in uh, chat has gone. I do. Do I dare read? <laughs> Twitch you <should>. you. <laughs> Cracks knuckles. You're telling me shutters. Yeah. I, yeah. It it all starts with uh, I think I'm Linda's reply just, to just, Jordan. I, I caught the end of that. I'm good. That's all I need. <laughs> Nothing like reaching up a man's willy with a rod to make you feel powerful. <laughs> Listen, man. <laughs> sometimes you have to assert dominance, and sometimes that dominance requires fiberglass rods, all right? It's I'm like, just saying. Kudos. Seriously, kudos. <laughs> Oh, no, I can't post that. <laughs> Never mind. Keep going. <laughs> Too hot for Twitch? <laughs> Too dark for Twitch, maybe? Mm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I, I have a massive collection of things that, like, yeah, I just can't share those. Just, no. <laughs> Yeah, of the like whenever I get some downtime at work, I'll start going into like the Reddit's, mm -hmm. and it's like, ah, hey, we're we're out, we're out, like right now, we're at work. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> yeah, I, I keep that on like a tablet. Just, <laughs> but you see, Google Photos is like saved my hard drive. Because now I have all the fucked up photos. Because, I mean, let's face it. We've been collecting fucked up photos since I've been on the internet. Like, that was always like a <laughs> yeah. folder. Now it's just, boom. I could just have everything. Yeah, my pictures folder is uh, almost two gigabytes now of mostly teeny tiny, like, 200 or 300 by 300 JPEGs that I downloaded <laughs> off the internet. <laughs> That's just like my Google, like most of my, um, I, I don't even want to look. <laughs> let's, let's, <laughs> yeah. better left to the imagination. I don't want to know how much of my storage is eaten up just by dumb photos. Of... That one started, um, well, it started when I put my, when I put the first iteration of this box together in 2014 mm -hmm. with the FX8370. Because the hard drive is still the same. The folder is still the same. <laughs> so it just keeps increasing. <laughs> I think I owe everyone a new subreddit to go look at. Um, it's been a while. Oh yeah, you haven't mentioned like the subreddit of the week for the past two weeks. Yep. I give you our hitbox porn IRL. <laughs> 
Ah, uh, it's just going to be Counter Strike and Overwatch. Oh no, nope. no, it isn't. <laughs> Not even remotely. <laughs> well, that pupper really, really wanted some pets. <laughs> I had to make what? Sure with the class. <laughs> no, I'm just looking at like the um the mattress flying into the dude's motorcycle. <laughs> I no no one can see copy and paste. It's like the the second one down. If you click the link, you copy saw it. Copy and paste, you lazy fuck. <laughs> Because I don't have it open. I literally don't know which, what you're talking about. Uh. Oh, it's a video. Damn it. <laughs> How long does it take you to tie your boots? Uh, about 10-ish minutes. 10 minutes? To actually do everything up, yeah. <laughs> Both of them. That was infinitely worse than I thought. Never mind. <laughs> you win. <laughs> no. Oh, you have, still have the question mark at the end. <laughs> Damn, no love. No, it's a video. It re-renders it as an MP4, so it doesn't show up. <laughs> Let's take... Finally! <laughs> what happened? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that looks like it should... It, it, that should have been on motorcycle logistics. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <sighs> uh. Man, I was looking for a shock mount for this fucking mic. And the one that fits it. Okay. How much how much is a spider mount? Like that. Like ten quid? Uh this was like uh seven? Yeah. Seven pounds, yeah. <laughs> yes. What a shock mount for this motherfucker cost. That fits it. Uh twenty. I'll give you three guesses. That's one. Okay, uh, 30. And the last one's going to be 47. Not even at halfway. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Right? <laughs> How thick is that thing? <laughs> I know those feels. <laughs> Because it's got to be wide enough for the fucking microphone. It's going to be like some massive, horrible thing. I don't even know if I want to tango with it, to be honest with you. Because this one is, like, pretty adjustable if you actually get it wide open. It, it gets pretty thick. <laughs> well, this is... I went and got the AT2020. I was like, I know I shoehorned the AT2020 in this old shock mountain. Now, now admittedly, yeah. when I removed it, it, like, peeled the padding off because it was so tight. <laughs> <laughs> it technically fit, but yeah, it's like yeah. geek delusion, baby. Nah, man, RGBs. That that that. Listen, ladies, that might actually work on a dude. I'm just saying. <laughs> like, in I don't know. Like, if, don't... if 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 I go into some lady's bedroom and I see a bunch of RGB, it's kind of a red flag because of all the red blinking lights. <laughs> all right, hang on. You walk in, transparent side window, tempered glass, and it's all rainbowy and shit. It's like, did you put that together, or was that a gift from your ex? See, I, I, I'd have to do that <laughs> when case did by you case, find right? Out, like, like, girls. 
<laughs> Which is fine. There's nothing wrong I, with that. I, I, That's I, just a so, shit thing to find out in the middle of a relationship. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That no, RGB I, computer shows up. And you're like, oh man. Well, man, so so okay. it, the, so alternatively, the question becomes, how picky are you? <laughs> It's, it's like, okay, turn time. that on. I want to see just you exactly the, the kind of rainbow puke well, you it's have all, to it's, it. it's a very inopportune time to find out that you suffer from epileptic seizures. <laughs> That's a horrible date. You're like, oh, here. I'm like, oh, you have a PC. Oh, take a look. <laughs> Foaming in the mouth. Yeah, like, oh, it looks great. Can I, can I borrow <laughs> a belt? I need to... <laughs> <laughs> also, don't do that. That doesn't help people. From, you don't swallow your tongue. <laughs> No, uh, what you want to do is stop them from biting their tongue off. Yeah. <laughs> don't don't get don't give them scissors. You want yeah you want to LGC pro tip: if someone you know is having a seizure, stick a wall into their mouth to make sure that their tongue is depressed, and make sure that there's a pillow under their head so that they don't smash their head in. And hope yeah. they don't die from the diseases from your wallet. <laughs> yeah. You can use their wallet. Think about this. All right. Let's see who's got the high score. Also, it helps to roll them on their sides so that they don't choke. They don't like. When you're done playing with your epilepsy. Where was I going? Epilepsy? Epilepsy. Yeah, I, I'm, trying to, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to flesh this word out. Um, <laughs> Epileptic. Yeah. Ep, yeah. Uh, oldest wallet. I did the maths on that. Because... Uh, for a dude's wallet, let's be honest, a, a chunk of leather is going to last a minute. Yeah. That, that is way too new and shiny. Uh, this is an Amazon wallet from when I first moved here. <laughs> so it it's about two years shielding? old. Yes, yes it does. <laughs> Who's the... Oh, never mind. It's a five yeah. pound. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's just, Pedro, are you secretly in love with the queen? Uh, you got some bad news on that one, buddy. Uh, yeah. Queen the Churchill. Queen? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Ch Ch Churchill. Churchill's a queen. <laughs> to be fair, the queen is on the other side. Oh, fair <laughs> yeah. I mean, I mean, it's, it's like, like Commonwealth money, right? So the odds thirty are the years ago, on. but yeah. yeah. <laughs> Saddleback Leather Company. How about you, Jordan? Do you even do Canadians have wallets? Yeah, I. So what I ended up doing was, you know, you know how some of the wallets have like that removable middle piece so that you can stick like Velcro. an ID. Um. <laughs> no, it's just like a like a little leather sleeve has some cards in it, has an okay. ID. Yeah. I'm trying to. I, for the longest time, I was doing like um, wallet in the back pocket. Okay, Basil. Ten years. All right. Fourteen years. Yeah, the question was, how long have you had it, Jordan? How long have I had it? A couple years. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the previous one I had before that was seven years. I mathed mine out. Actually, I was talking to my mom, and I asked her, I've had mine for 25 years. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> because she gave me static about getting it. This is how I was able to track it down, because it was a chained wallet. <laughs> And she's like, you should not get that. And I was like, but I won't look. I, I was just doing the little kid shit. I just want to be cool, have a chain wallet, man. They, you just want to have a chain dangling from your pants, yeah. Pretty much, man. And I was like, but I All won't cool lose it, and it. it'll be practical. And it's like, I just want to go for a chain wallet. So, yeah. <laughs> My mom was just like, oh, yes, that was whenever that. And I was like, all right. And I still have it, man. It, it's just perfectly in one piece. You know, it's just like a black leather with, like, two studs on it that or copper yep. now because the chrome's polished off. They were delicious, <laughs> both of them. Um, yeah, I, I too mince. like to lick metal. <laughs> I actually really like those mice that you can like plug in and charge, but then if you unplug them, they're just like a Bluetooth mouse. Oh, no, that one. Yeah, this one. This one's still running. We're coming up on year two with the uh, Logitech. Uh, yeah, I have, I have like LA. four of these guys, so... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my other wireless mouse is a little different. Yeah. Er er honestly, I've bought like a G502 every time they go on sale for like under 50 bucks. 
You, you can get locked into a good gerbil, man. I did that with the uh, MX500 wireless ones. Yeah. Like, I was paying ridiculous amounts for like broken ones on eBay so I could Frankenstein new ones together. Yeah, there's nothing wrong getting locked into a good um, a G903. Oh, and like, what was the... I, it's in the closet now. We were looking that up online. I have a knack for picking the fucking gerbil that oh the yeah it turns into like a hundred and twenty fucking dollars man mm. it was like 250 on amazon here <laughs> <laughs> it's like really <laughs> people people get like attached to their peripherals dude it's it a thing. There's, there's an economy there there absolutely is a secondary economy for that it's fucked up still rocking the brocat kova because mm. the uh Drivers for uh, the M55 RGB still not there. <laughs> and yeah, the, even though the Rocat uh, developer for the Linux drivers isn't really doing it anymore, this still works. Everything works. So yeah. <laughs> the I like the. It's good, man. I, I like this uh, one. Uh, I mean, Mir, I was looking at that. The only thing that turned me away from that was the thimble. Let's get into it. You know, you know the thing with me and trackball mice is I end up universally just like taking the ball out to just fidget with it, and then I'll launch it somewhere, and they'll mm. be like, well, shit, I need my mouse back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see, this one's like just a little smaller than a cue ball. Mm. So, like, home invasion? Ooh. <laughs> la launch it at the dude. <laughs> or just, like, throw it as a warning shot into the wall and be like, really? Yeah, I got more of them, I swear! The other one I looked at that was a trackball, this is the first time I've ever had a trackball, was that um, Kensington Expert. Okay. Which is, like, another just large ball on the top. It's got, like, four buttons. Tone expert. But instead of having a, like a scroll wheel, it had like a scroll circle around the ball. It was like, that's either going to be really, really sweet or it's going to suck and it's going to break. Yeah. Oh, is it good to do the iPod thing that you yeah. like swipe one way and it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But I found a. I posted a video about how to do it, how to use a. How to reprogram. This one, if I hold down the third button. That turns the ball itself into a scroll wheel, three dimension, three D. So I can speed scroll with the ball. It's great. Speed scroll. Speed scroll. Best scroll. Kens yeah, Kensington has been making good shit for a, a minute. Like, <laughs> I mean, it's the shit that comes with what when when you order a Dell, right? They're like, would you like to add a bunch of Kensington shit to it? Ah. You know, people have like uh, a and now they use the really stupidly for expensive. The, uh, what was it? The, Microsoft Intelli balls. I don't know what it was called. It was the trackball of Microsoft. Everyone's like, it's the perfect trackball. And those things. I mean, go Microsoft for peripherals were never money. bad. There's yeah, Microsoft mice especially. It's like people were really yeah, fucking Microsoft keyboard, onto that. Man. I mean, it, it <laughs> yeah, is, I, I mean, like, what, like <sighs> it's not. I, I, I don't know. Does Microsoft actually make them, or do they just like re they have like a generic Chinese manufacturer? That they this label? this is Microsoft shit. This this is like even got like carrying magnetic clips on the back for the carry. I mean, yeah, these aren't cheap, unfortunately. Yeah, the entire back of this thing is magnetic. <laughs> yeah, I mean it's a fucking mouse, right? Like. <laughs> That's that's really what it ultimately boils down to for your mouse or your keyboard. It's like, do you do you oh, like it? Damn, right. she. Mm, look at that. I just took my pants off. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it looks like if you flip that over, the purple light might reveal some stains. Don, that, I'll tell you what that looks like, Don. That looks like something I would break. Those are surprisingly sturdy. There's a couple of people at work that really like those. Structurally, I see how that would hold together. But it, but there would you, be you the mental thing it. of like... They're heavy. They're really heavy. It's like you pick them up, it's like, oh, this shouldn't be this heavy. <laughs> They're just like made of tungsten or some shit. Mm. 
I don't know. They feel like plasticky rubber You're made thing. out of file uh, system patents? <laughs> Probably. Oh, no. Appa- apparently, 5.4 uh, is introducing the kernel level x fat support. I'm running it right now, baby. What are you talking about? Yeah. Yeah. So, did you, like, plug in a SD card and be like, yeah, fat, but with, like, nah. large files? <laughs> nope. <laughs> oh man, it's so big. It's so much larger than 3.7 gigabytes. I'm so hard right now. Actually, do you want to know an interesting thing? The PlayStation 4 supports XFAT, but not NTFS. That makes sense. <laughs> well, I would really wouldn't expect it to f- f- support hey, NTFS. Un- un- unfortunately, Microsoft's Windows kind barely of in a supports position. NTFS. I mean, we're we're. we're Unfortunately, they're in position where they uh, they can just sort of dictate the default file system that shit's supported, that's or that shit's purchased with. Well, I do always like the confusion of the Windows users when you start rattling off the different files. It's like, what do you mean? It's like, yeah, oh, yeah. you pick the, the one that they're, you they're all use, good. mix and match, you know, for yeah, like the, the recording drives. I use XFS because I'm bucking them right in the brains with a shitload of data streams, you know? Yep. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, XFS and EXT4 are very, very fast. BTRFS and ZFS have a bunch of weird fucking features. If you like murdering people, there's RiserFS. ZFS um, is yep. really, it's going to be really awesome any day now. And yeah. <laughs> um, there's that, there, actually, one, one, one I've been meaning to try is there's that um, SSDFS, which is like that Samsung one that's supposed to be optimized for like flash memory. That- F2FS? That sounds yeah, interesting, it. but dangerous. Right? Like, <laughs> F2FS works, uh, and it works really well uh, for SD cards, but that's not, about not, as uh, not for, not for SSDs. brave as I've been with it. <laughs> yeah, right? Like, I mean, I got, I got a bunch of spare SSDs, right? I might as well try it. Um, yeah, then, then you get into, like, network file systems, and you're like, dude, man... There's, there's a whole world of it, and I really, what what pisses me off is that a lot of Android phones just straight up don't have EXT support, and that boggles the mind. Like you have to go out of your way to disable it in the Linux kernel that you ship. A little bit. What yeah, the fuck? Google tried that. Google tried that with a Chromebook. It's like, the fuck are you doing? Oh, but it's more uh, work for us. No, it fucking isn't. Oh, no, yeah, you're it, right. it's, it's, it's more work to, like, make menu config and track down the fucking file system section. <laughs> Katana, I ran Riser, like, even a little while after it got stabby. Yeah. I like I said, if, if you really enjoy system. murdering women, you can use RiserFS. Because that's how that works. Yeah. But, yeah, this is the box where I keep all the um, laptop stuff. And uh, there's two very cheap light on SSDs right here. <laughs> I, I'm still baffled. They were like that, ten like, pounds each for 120 Hyundai gigs. Makes SSDs, <laughs> right? Like, yeah, some weird ass relabels. Well, you think about how just how cheap it is, though. Like for these, uh, the Dell Optiplexes. Thanks, Mike. Um, I just did, laptop uh, RAM. It, it was a no brainer, dude. <laughs> these freaking Kingston 120 gigs. Nine dollars. Oh yeah, you can for like the tiny SSDs. I don't think you can get under one hundred twenty anymore. No, Western Digital Blue laptop drive. <laughs> and then Pennywise, Pennywise is hanging. He's like, we're even play fucking Rocket Cars. Pennywise <laughs> gave us like the quad Western core, Digital uh, Black Intel. <laughs> oh, he thinks With Windows care- Ten on it. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Everybody pay, pay attention to Pedro's junk that he should throw it's away. It's uh, <laughs> potato. <laughs> oh, yeah, this box is full of junk. So Pedro is on stream showing off his junk. What else mm-hmm. is new? Streaming. Too hot for Twitch. Potato. Domo. Do you own a potato peeler, Jordan? No. I probably should. Why? Because, I don't know, I'll, I'd peel more potatoes. <laughs> I own... Way too much, Mike G. Way too much. <laughs> Out of his box or the box? Um, the box. I bought a potato peeler to peel the zucchini. 
Yeah. Yeah. That's why I own one. It wasn't like a random act of adulting. It was like, no, I need that to make the zucchini noodle things. Oh, you're making zucchini noodles. Yeah, I did. At one time. <laughs> never the one the one time yeah, and never again. That, that, dude, I bought like a what are those like smash things that has like different inserts and shit to like chop up veg? A food processor? That thing got smushed. Well, this is like a manual metal one, dude. And like a slap chop? Something like that, but with a price tag on it. Um, <laughs> so like a slap chop? <laughs> no, Jordan, this is hinge. Slap chops are not hinged. Mm. It might be too advanced Oh, like, one, like a... Not like a mandolin. I know, yes. I know what you're talking about. Like a mandal... Damn it, I want to turn that into Mandalorian, but I don't know how to get there. A Mandalorian, um, yes. Ma no, it's got to be Mandalandolin. <laughs> man <laughs> man Mandalandolin. Well, yeah, you, you have a, 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 a vibrating vegetable cutter. That's what it's that's what it's good for. Fiber knife. Fiber knife. Vibro knife. Vibro chop. Vibro shot slap chop. That <laughs> has to exist shop. in Star Wars. I want to get a job writing Star Wars. Why does it Comics have a power like cord? Books. Do not question the vibro chop. <laughs> It's a Vibra Slap Chop, man. It uses the force. <laughs> Watch this. You're going to love my nuts. No, I'm vibrophobic. Oh, man, you got to be more tolerant of vibration. Do you think there's vibrophobic <laughs> armor? So it'd be like armor vibrating at like the opposite frequency? It would have to be. I mean, there, there's like anti uh, light stick armor and shit, right? Yeah, like that. That's you, that's what the the scar steel is usually made to use to make. Mm. Yeah, um, the, the it's a Mandalorian iron is what it used to be called in the old canon before the Disney's <laughs> BD. Yeah, but but uh, they they kept, they kept that. It looks like. Um, yeah, there, there's a there's a bunch of shit that can repel lightsabers. Um, <laughs> including other lightsabers. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, my armor is made entirely of lightsabers. <laughs> it's it's a little toasty. <laughs> Everyone, pay attention. I can only do this once. And... <laughs> right. <laughs> I mean, oh, if dude, it's articulated like, properly, it could work. Did, did oh you think God. like one of those like fly buzzers <laughs> could work? <rip out? laughs> Look, if Kylo Ren can have a fucking lightsaber with a cross guard, then yeah. we can have a fucking armor made out of lightsabers, right? <laughs> you know, in the new Star Wars that they're doing, I really hope they redo the, um, what's a Ray's, like, hinged light, because that looked janky as fuck, and we all know it. Just, like, yeah. Drop down. I was like, they, they, no, that, that, so no. that looks like something I would have come up with. Like, right. I, I mean, the, the, the counter argument is like, that's actually a thing that's been in Star Wars for a while. Well, they it's, need it, they, it, it looked bad then and it looks bad now. Filmography, they gotta work, they, they gotta like put some yeah. like that. No, that, just, that looks like fan made type shit. Yeah, the, 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 the Jedi Guard used to wield those uh, types of lightsabers. That was, that was their jib, their uh, gym. Their jib. Their jip, their jimp, their jump. Jip. Their jump. <laughs> They're just saber staffs that. Fold. <laughs> Origami lightsaber. No, that's a bad idea. I mean, I mean Let's make all, all that shit's probably going to be in a flashback anyways, or like a force vision, so. Man, <laughs> dude, our, our Mandalorian boy, man, anytime metal hits metal. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we're, 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 we're finding out. We know, we know why he doesn't like droids now. <laughs> did, did we find that out? Yeah, yeah it's because his father, his father and mother were killed by that super battle droid. In the Clone Wars. Yep. <laughs> oh, all right. I might have fast forwarded over that part. Yeah. Possibly. Did I? That's why you don't fast forward. You get all that juicy character development. Nope. Too busy. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just ask you, man. Like, oh, I don't remember that part. Yeah, and 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 then the Mandalorian and Baby Yoda just started making out. It was awesome. I gotta go back and watch it. Um. <laughs> To be fair, Baby Yoda is like 50, so... Yeah. <laughs> That's dark, Pedro. Um, no. <laughs> I, I, like, I'm, I'm expecting the twist to be like, Baby Yoda is just like playing stupid. It's not like actually a baby. It's like, no, everyone's gonna treat me like a baby. I'm just gonna act like one. No one's gonna question it and go about my business. 
Yeah, yeah, that, mm. that, I saw that one too. It's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> that one got a sincere laugh out of it. It's like, yep. Yeah. Panic dog face is usually pretty good. <laughs> there's there's probably like some salami in the other room and it's just like hey, it, it, it's rare when, you know, all along the watchtower it fires up in the back of your brain and, yeah, and like yeah. Fortunate son. Mm. Some folks are on to raise the flag. Just aim lower. Okay, let me get a uh, drink and we'll do some rocket cars. How, cars. how can you murder rocket innocent cars. women and children? You don't lead them as much. Uh oh. He posted something. What are you, what, what are the long-haired Strider. <laughs> Music, Music for, for Mandalorians. Mandalorians. <laughs> There's like a sexy chick with a snake, I guess. Oh, this yeah. is the way. Okay. <laughs> it is the way. Oh, Strider, you, know you used the way. that image I made. Yay. I should say I made <laughs> the image I fed into an app. This is Strider at, uh, what was that scale they were in? Yeah. Yeah. Cool t-shirt, bro. <laughs> Strider's letting his hair grow. Like I said, he's turning he's, into he's, Tilda Swinton. I, 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 I gotta ask somebody if it's okay to share a picture of them because both of you motherfuckers can go, I see what you're on about. Ah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I still need to get me some of that uh, LGC merch at some point. I need a new hoodie. This is like the only one I have. <laughs> I, I think I think I'm gonna get the use me shirt. Just wear it as a gym shirt. <laughs> yeah, but I know that if I go there and I buy a hoodie, I have to buy Nori a uh, Hell Elks uh, strawberry mayo hoodie. So, yeah. <laughs> so that you two match. Are, are 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 you that kind of couple where you like coordinate your outfits? Oh hell no. <laughs> it's basically I wear black all the time and uh Nori just goes out for all the colors and it's like really shiny stuff. It's like, yeah, right, cool. <laughs> We are polar opposites. <laughs> For some I mean, reason, I don't think we have I don't think we have the rights to sell Symphony X merch uh, <laughs> down incognito. They do put on a pretty good live show though. They did they, they 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 did their like Odyssey song in full and that's like twenty two minutes long, so that was pretty awesome. Also, the lady on this shirt has like a firewire port and a serial port in her head. <laughs> it's pretty stupid. Not as stupid as the Yoda in sunglasses, though. Needs to be Baby Yoda or get the fuck out. You want you you, you want to plug your cable into my boob? Come on, firewire. Stick it in, <laughs> stick it in me, baby. I don't know why, but I have a uh, firewire cable. <laughs> okay. Can you plug your nose into the computer? I could. No, I and couldn't. You're going actually. to. I right could plug it into one of those laptops that actually has a firewire port, but then power uh, it on. Yeah, not this particular computer. No, <laughs> that's a shame. We need to put a firewire card on your wish list so that you can interface, and then you can like stick it up your nose and as a goof be like, "I am interfaced." <laughs> I have no Just idea where that cable beforehand. came from, but uh, yeah, I I have a firewire cable. <laughs> Bragging, dude. I got like two. 
<laughs> That's the thing. It's a, mir- I have it's a miracle. With firewire. I have fuck all idea where that cable came from. <laughs> Uh, it's maybe you were like he, I he's just a kleptomaniac. Theories. He steals things <laughs> for no reason, just for the sick thrill. See, I get you beat there. There's I, nothing I, with firewire at work either, yeah. so it couldn't have come from work, <laughs> right? Andrew, so it, it, it makes off. sense to steal it, right? Mine's, like, <laughs> dude, I have a legitimate use for one. So die in a fire—that's worse, far worse than having like I did. Weird D- die name. in a firewire. Yep. D I D I A F W. I I don't know how fast can you get death over firewire. Purple. Mm. Okay, um, we're gonna light up the after shows, so there's your warning. Oh shit, motherfucker! Damn, Helm was first. <laughs> Jill. Scott, see who's paying attention. All right, I'm gonna launch rocket cars and then I'm gonna go take a piss. I'll be right back. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> Let me get Discord audio set up. Reload. There they are. All right, down. You will get an invite. Just make sure you're friends with Linux Game... Am I Linux Gamecast on Steam? Are you Linux Gamecast on Steam? Okay. I, you, I have you as slut butt, so... Or, no, I have you as ass slut. Mm. No, I have you as butt ass. God damn, I'm just wrong all the I time. I have you as early onset Alzheimer's. Um... Uh, view profile. You are Venn, apparently. Okay, I'm just Venn. All right. Seems legit. Um, yeah, Pe- Pedro is ass slut. Sandy is slut butt near butt ass. It's been a while. Not gonna do it. And what does that make me? Yes. Uh. I don't. I don't fucking know. Someone I don't care enough about to change <laughs> the name on Steam. <laughs> the LGC lab rat oh, slut oh. and fox dog. <laughs> Did you just say a naughty word, Jill? Oh, burn! You got burned by a Language, Jill. Jill. <laughs> wow! I mean, it's not even an accurate insult either. Foxy's right. like the opposite of a slut. He's like such a prude. Aww. <laughs> Scott, you're an executive producer, dude. You always get an invite. But, I mean, tone down with that Canadian politeness shit. You're giving people a false impression. Eh? Eh, buddy? (laughs) Anyways. What controller do you normally use for Rocket League? I really like the Steam controller for Rocket League. I I use this controller for fucking everything. Hmm. But I like with the I'm Steam using controller. The Elite two now. What was that? I'm using the Elite Two now. Like Xbox. Yep, you found a way to be more dead to me, Scott. Um, <laughs> how much was that thing? That thing had to have been stupid expensive in Canada. Yeah, it's like eighty yeah. bucks. Yeah. No, this is the new no. new one. Uh, the new new one. Very. Oh, it's probably higher. like 120 bucks. Closer to 200. No higher. Yeah. Just a couple kidneys. Man. It was a stupid birthday this, uh, gift for myself that I was also kind of being like, well, I can write a post about it. That'll justify part of the cost. Nice thing about it is that version has white or Bluetooth built in, whereas the yeah. previous one, you had to have the special dongle. Yeah, I did have the dongle, so I was fine, but. You didn't need a, the that, that's the thing, under Linux you don't need a special game. dongle, you just need to not run kernel 5.3 apparently. And then yeah. you'll have Bluetooth. <laughs> Jordan is my oh, dongle. Bluetooth and I'm running 5.3, so I'm fucked. The <laughs> Xbox Elite controller did not support Bluetooth. The original one did not support Bluetooth, so Correct. you didn't have a choice. You had to use okay. a dongle or... Dongle or bus. Oh, I know it's PS4 controller. 
You know, I'm gonna make a porno called porno called Dongo Dongle or Bust. Dongo or Bust. Dongo or Bust. Yeah. yeah. Dongle Dongo. Dongo. That's guys... that's the main character's name. Um, Shit, that's actually a decent Dongle. name. Dongle. God damn it. Yeah, it is. Dongle Dongo. <laughs> Where is the circle cam group? Draw, draw then a dead dingo's dong. Let's get window capture. Locked how do you in. know how dry a dead dingo's butt is? There you go. You say. I didn't say butt. I said dong. <laughs> but dong. Okay, same question. <laughs> yes, I have seen a dead dingo's dong. All right. How do you know how dry it is? I know how dry. Have you have you touched it? Did you taste it? Oh, I had to move the bloody thing. So yes. <laughs> <laughs> you, don't, you, 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 don't, you don't have like animal control in Australia. We we're like equipped to dispose of dead He's animals. On the fucking road, you idiot. <laughs> again, you don't have animal yeah, control so again, in Australia. No, we're not way out in the back, out back. You're not. What about All the right. back? Bum fuck no way. Okay. <laughs> if you hit something out there, it stays on the side of the road. So what? What does what does rabies actually feel like? <laughs> I haven't had rabies. Because <laughs> you have <Yet>. rabies. <laughs> Still present yeah, okay, tense. I'll give you that. I've probably got, ra I've probably got rabies. I'm just... <laughs> not, not, not How can you tell? <laughs> How do you know if a ginger has rabies, though? That's a fair question. Well, I mean, I mean, like, you actually... If you get rabies, you're going to die pretty soon. It's not... Yeah, no, not dude. I think gingers produce that. natural antibodies. They've like got a 50 medicines 50. for it. They, yeah, they they do have medicines for rabies now, but um, like yeah, yeah left yeah. untreated, <laughs> like straight up kill you in a few weeks, right? Like mm -hmm. mouth foam. Yeah, there 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 is a reason where you're like, yeah, man, you should get a rabies shot like right the fuck now. Oh, dude, so you're saying there's a bunch of dead procrastinators? Probably. Like I'll get around. <laughs> or wait, I'll get around to my own face off. <laughs> It's like same with this tetanus. surprises tetanus you how? <laughs> oh, we're, we're, we're Party was rooms. destroyed due to a connection error. Wow. Oh. oh well, okay. Hey. Um, but, not oh yeah. Party that dropped out in. of the thing. All right. Weird. Um, is there a space for one more? May I ask? Well, dude, we I'll tell you what. If you're like so. online and in the game for like once, maybe. Oh, oh fuck God! Fuck, I I did. Nah. God damn it! I closed it down because See? people were bloody annoying me, so I turned myself offline. All right. Not my in. problem, bruh. I know it's not your bloody problem. I'm just pissed off. All right, I'm there. So we leave the party then? <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah we, gonna... we have Artifacts Monday as friends. We should invite them to play Rocket League. Yeah, right. <laughs> it's like, no, there's not enough hidden objects. <laughs> <laughs> Midnight Magic, thank you for the follow. <laughs> um, Eat that banana, Pedro. Oh, thank you, Ben. <laughs> you need to you need to consume more potassium. Hey, my yes. Eat more I said I had a shitload of invites, so... More fiber, Pedro. <laughs> hey, I'm not gonna eat you more. I'm not gonna eat the peel. <laughs> Jill, are you implying he that he needs to eat more fiber because he's full of shit? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and I need to release a set shit. <laughs> Like I was yeah. saying earlier, uh, Jill has some uh, cutting, cutting undertones. <laughs> Is that how you empty out your shit? You cut yourself open and go, yeah, there we go. Yep. <laughs> sure, Foxy, why not? Let's go with that. <laughs> Listen, man, he tries to make funny. It just, you know, it's Australian humor. <laughs> it's just not good. <laughs> Clearly not enough spiders involved. You can always use more spiders. <laughs> spiders are hilarious. What are you talking about? They're great. Oh, no. They're just like... Especially when you give them drugs. <laughs> <laughs> you, you're being dead serious, too, which is the funny I, I am. Yeah, yeah you can, you can, you oh, can no, give spiders drugs. Video. It's fucking hilarious. <sighs> yeah, it's fucking hilarious. Yeah, I saw that... Uh, Tiny tiny clip of a documentary. <laughs> you ever just sat sat around, got high with a spider? Yep. <laughs> His name was Jimmy. Oh, Pie Chris Burton. Random. Thank you very much for the follow. <laughs> Let's dance. All right, who do I got? I got Pedro dance. Pennywise, 
And I got Scoots and Alan. Uh, we're, we're, we're waiting and on. And I got Mr. Pox Dog. A All pox right. on you, dog. <laughs> All a right. pox yeah, upon your dog. Pox dog times. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Yay. <laughs> Didn't get demoed. I'll take that <laughs> as a win. I did. Hi, Scott. Oh. <laughs> Scott, you got it. Stay brave. Oh, good Pennywise. Very good Pennywise. <laughs> That's it, up. Whoa, where, you know, where am I going? Where That's am right. Where I'm a goal setting bitch. Deal with it. Not your mom. Uh, God, God damn it. Fuck you all. <laughs> old man Vin. <laughs> oh, old man Vin. Miss the ball. <laughs> <laughs> On this map. Well, I didn't hit the ball, but I hit Scott into the ball, which hit it in the right direction. Good so. going, Alan. Way to compensate. <laughs> Whoa, no! Oh, uh, fuck's oh. sake, Pennywise. That was almost good. Unch. <laughs> Unch. Nope. Fuck you. Ah. There. There. That's going the right uh, way again. Nope. That's me. Nope. Jump out the ball. That's a strut. <laughs> Sometimes Play. it works. Alan, Play get with out the there. Boys. Hi, Scott. <laughs> you dick. <laughs> That's Scott. He's a dick. Scott's <laughs> custom. To that greeting. Hi, oh, yeah. I'm Scott. Oh, <laughs> sorry, God. Foxy didn't see you. Uh, there. That's all right. I'm just doing backflips. Okay. Oh, uh, somebody can go. I tried. <laughs> Oh. oh no, she did on that. Ha. Oh wow. There's a lot of not hitting that ball taking place. Um, <laughs> I hit it slightly. Defense! Defense! Damn it. <laughs> Damn it, I couldn't kill Alan. That would have been great. Cuss you. Oh, hey. Oh, okay. Yep. Hmm. That's not Very good, good Foxy. Damn it. <laughs> Alan, out of uh, everyone, I no, didn't expect not so that good, from you. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, not good. Come on. I'll pass back to you, Pedro. Uh, oh, Millie. That's my goal now, Pedro. <laughs> no, it isn't. <laughs> Look at me. I'm the goalie now. <laughs> oh, dude. That I should be a goes. thing, dude, where you could spy, <laughs> where you could get a temporary paint. <sighs> that might be fun for Rumble. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wow. Strike one. Alan, you got it? All right. Wait, I'll be here uh, flailing uh, around aimlessly. Hey, I just went through Pennywise. Oh, <laughs> I got ju tried to juke him, but he juked me. Oh, come on, lads. <laughs> no. Fuck you. Nope. Oh, Mr. Alert. Zigged when I should have zagged. God yeah. damn it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh. I left too early. I left too early. <laughs> yes, yes, I did. My bad. Yeah. Nope, nope. Someone got to it before me. Um. <laughs> Yeah, you go, Pedro. I'm, I'm happy uh, that you do. Ah. Nope. That, that wasn't okay. gonna happen. Get it, Alan. <laughs> fuck it up. I mean, in a good way. Pause the fuck up. Speak. And nice. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it. Nice. My flailing confused the other team. Right, Foxy, you're going next time. I'm just gonna say back. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> I hit that. No, I, I, I guess I guess I'm in goal. Unless someone wants to take over. I guess over. I'm yeah, going then. Ha. Yeah. <laughs> huh. I'm sorry in advance. <laughs> no one demo Jordan. It won't be worth your time. <laughs> <laughs> just just hit the ball towards him. Oh. Just hit him with the um, anxiety. <laughs> oh, God damn it. Oh, God. Yeah, oh, damn it. That was uh, quick. Too low. <laughs> that was too quick. low. <laughs> Ho, ho, ho. Mary, because fuck you. Uh, That's yeah. why. 
Oh man. Canada oh, and well, Canada we had violence. Two and a half minutes of uh, <laughs> sort of even that play field. Yeah, it's pretty balanced. I'm down with this. Yeah. <laughs> Going on, so yeah, it's pretty balanced. Oh, yep. Oh, uh oh. <laughs> ah, oh, God, oh, fucking oh, damn it. <laughs> oh, well, nope. kinda. I was very near the ball when it was hit, so fuck you. Mm. Oh, for fuck's sake, who's not back there? Just let oh, it go. I got Simon go again. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Who earns? Oh, okay. well done, Jordan. Oh, do you want to give him a pity ball? Uh, no. All right. <laughs> oh, no. Someone, anyone? No. Uh, uh, I was going to give you props, but that was a uh, uh, <laughs> Foxy on the board. <laughs> I got an assist for that. That was a good setup. Whoop. Yep. It's messed up, man. <laughs> Didn't think we'd go out like that. <laughs> you mean winning? Yes. It was going the right way. <laughs> Well, I did better than Pedro and Ven somehow. Mm. <laughs> yes, you did. <laughs> Good job, Jordan. It's a small victory. Yeah. The two balls I pushed away from the goal apparently didn't count a save. So, nope. <laughs> I I thought I should have got a couple centers, but you know, I I, I hit the ball like twice, so I'm good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like contributed is what I'm saying. Oh yeah, Th I mean that's all I'm really hoping for, right? Like, did I do something to not completely fuck our team up? Because there, there's like legitimately five minute periods where it's just nothing but air, man, and you see like across whiff. the map. Yeah, you right. whiff. Oh, whiff. so so many whiffs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think it's time for a oh, speaking of driving to Candy Van, let me change my car. How oh, dare <laughs> Someone clip that, please. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> when we get him falsely accused of something, we'll use that as exhibit A. <laughs> right. <laughs> Does your car happen to be a van? Candy Van. No. <laughs> he's, he's Candy Van. <laughs> Free pancake. I swear it doesn't say free candy on the side. <laughs> See, there was a simpler time when you could get away with that joke. <laughs> no, officer, seriously, it's a Not joke. Not anymore. LOL. Like, don't cuff me, bro. <laughs> yeah, nowadays it's literally, don't taste me, bro. Don't taste me. <laughs> Let's see. Well, no nowadays, it, it, depending on who you are, it may not. It may just be like, please don't shoot me, officer. <laughs> I'll do whatever you say. Just don't shoot me, please. Uh, hi, American <laughs> Alphabet Agency. <Oscar> Hello. <laughs> I mean, worst well, comes to worst, the cop just gets paid administrative. Really, at leave, the end of the so. day, man, any country's alphabet agency is like, please don't disappear me. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Mi five. Mi six. We cool? We cool. All right, cool. <laughs> Better hope you are. They'll let you know if you're not. Daniel Craig shows up at your house. <laughs> it is all. Oh. You, you know you're jacked up. <laughs> it's Ooh. Pierce Brosnan and Sean Connery and Daniel Craig and whichever other Roger ones are Moore. still alive. George Lazenby. <laughs> Timothy Dalton. Timothy Dalton. <laughs> George Lazenby. Yeah, Timothy Roger Dalton. Roger Moore. Oh, yeah, Timothy Dalton's still around, yes. Ro zombie Roger Moore. Oh, what was the <laughs> That one, yeah, George, George that Lazenby. One. I responded George before Lazenby. he said yeah. still alive, so yeah. that's right. Um, Bond. I don't know who, who 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 played him in the 1967 Casino Royale movie. 
Oh, what, the TV one. Oh, fuck me. Uh, no names. I can't <laughs> David yeah. Niven. All right, fuck it. Yeah, I wouldn't have good luck yeah. with this one. <laughs> okay, I wouldn't have gotten David Niven. <laughs> yeah. But I. But would would you think back all the way to the the original Casino Royale? Uh, mm hmm. All right, Canada on Canada. Oh, puck. <laughs> oh shit! There's pucking. Scott, it's time oh, you pulled pucking, your Canadian weight. Pucking, pucking. And spi it's spiky bullshit. Ooh, spiky yeah. hockey. Spikes. Spiky hockey. Sit back and watch. <laughs> All right. At least you could. I'm not sure if jumping will help this time because of the grab. I think at this point it's just aim and press yeah. boost. Ah! <laughs> no. Oh, yeah, Get down that way. Damn it. Ah, yeah. damn it. Uh. It fucked up my steering. I could only uh, go wide. Got it. Oh. No, I can't turn. Get. Oh. Damn it, Scott. <laughs> go, Scott. Scott. Go, Scott. Go, Scott. Go, Scott. Uh. Yeah. Ah. Oh. No boost. Oh. Damn it. God, I God damn it. Damn it. <laughs> I got booped so many times. <laughs> Just I have no yeah, boost. <laughs> no boost. Yes. Yes. <sighs> yes. 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 That was. That was. That was, that was, that was my fault. <laughs> that was a. That was a. Oh, uh, that was some more shit. That was some great a horse shit. I felt so much boost. <laughs> Boosty that I'm getting lag spots. Wow. That happened. Uh, no! Go! 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 Yeah, oh, God damn it. Go, go Pennywise. Go Wee. Pennywise. No, Alan. Damn it. Right. Come back. Uh. <laughs> yeah, oh, fuck it up, Scott. Come fuck it up, no. Scott. No. Yes. Oh. Very good, Scott. Uh. <laughs> he didn't fuck it up. <laughs> He didn't fuck it up. <laughs> you did good. That was good waiting on the d d drop. <laughs> fuck it up, Scott. Good, good. That was awesome. <laughs> no, that's Scott. No hockey puck, Scott. <laughs> Why is there no one in gold? Because it's us. Oh, <laughs> damn it, Foxy! Hey. I had no boost, and all I could do the was Jordan sit there as like flooded. Foxy pushed me into the goal. <laughs> <laughs> I had nothing to fight back. I was trying to hit Jordan. Oh yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Come on, Jordan, chicken bag. Uh, 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 yeah. Yeah. Good job, man. <laughs> Shake. Shot. I don't know if it was a control that one, but it seemed good regardless. <laughs> yeah, that was wild flailing, Scott. <laughs> Especially when I said shaking me. Hey, hello. I just went flying through people. My leg is so bad. <laughs> nice. <laughs> me through the I mean, but seriously, Let what's me new? Play. Um, <laughs> Fuck off. What's new is God, right. Damn it! Someone I'll stole it from, from me. Yeah, yeah, it was Penny. <laughs> no, that was me, bitch. <laughs> ah, okay, no, I missed. <laughs> I couldn't say that twice. twice. <laughs> what happened there? <laughs> Uh, that happened. Well, that that was happened. happened. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off, Alan. <laughs> oh, I had no boost. Alright. Ow. It's Damn prime it. time. Damn it. Go, Scott! 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 What? Who the? That was my own team. Me. I was sabotaged. Ah! What? What? What's happening? <laughs> bad, the boost. bad and wrong. <laughs> That's... That? I just went flying no, in the completely dude. correct direction. Wrong way, DI. Wrong, wrong way. way. <laughs> Jesus. Yes. I'm surprised it took that long. 
<laughs> I had it, but then I tried to boost forward and I went into the air. <laughs> oh, that was, that was oh, not the correct direction to boost. Oh god. Why do I have to be in goal again? Because of what you did. Oh shit, I'm going the wrong way. The father. Fuck. That works. <laughs> I was touching it, and this box yes, did nothing. <laughs> ah, damn it! <laughs> you saw that. I was touching it, and the spikes did nothing. Yeah, but yeah, because you need to hit it. You were already touching it when the spikes went out. I was expecting Foxy to juke. I, know. I did not expect him to go straight forward. <laughs> <laughs> it's a genius play. In this case, I flew directly into them. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! Oh, just hit the roof for no reason. Ah, oh. oh, goddammit! <laughs> Put it in. Oh, There's no one in the goal. Oh. <laughs> ah. Goddammit! Yes, I'll take the assist again. <laughs> What the fuck is going on? All right, whatever, it works. It works. <laughs> Foxy. Oh, damn it. Go for the fucking pack, would you? No. I did. You booped me out of the way. <laughs> you ran into me. Uh -oh. No excuses, come on. You ran into me. Jeez. <laughs> There it is. <laughs> Gravity for the win. Uh, uh, and then Scott just like fucking strat. kicked me. And, yeah. <laughs> Scott, why'd you have to smooch me? Because I missed the puck, so I had to do something useful. <laughs> Smooching me isn't useful Ooh. or constructive. <laughs> He's got so a point, man. <laughs> yeah, don't smooch, Jordan. <laughs> He's just so damn smoochable. It's distracting. George's a little smoochy. Alright. Ah, damn it. Oh, God damn it. Sorry. Yes. 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 Damn it. I'll take the third assist. <laughs> False hope acquired. Alright. Oh, man. We got this team. Oh, C'est um, possible. C'est possible. <laughs> oh, oh, what dear. the it's fuck okay. is even... What the fuck even is this game? <laughs> I right. just went right Jordan. through then. Jordan. Yes. <coughs> Come on, that was right there. Yes. Ah. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, Whoa. And then and then I uh. went flying the end. <laughs> Damn it, Scott. That didn't work right. You should have not did that. <laughs> you shouldn't have did that, he just the boy. <laughs> no, you shouldn't have did that. Never mind. No. Our goalie no. fucked oh. off. Backwards. <laughs> <Show> off. <laughs> Very good, Mr. Show. Alert. I like the bad manners. Very good. <laughs> Wee! In my day, be a bounce. That's cool. Totally intentional. <laughs> intentional. Yes, I want to say showing off. Got stunted on. <laughs> no. Stop it. Bad manners. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Close enough. <laughs> Alan, you better not ever need an organ, because I'm not going to steal one for you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he is a boost hog. No black market organs for Alan. I mean, Alan can become black market organs. <laughs> Listen, man. <laughs> that could be black market organs from Alan. Just Go. No. Go, 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 go. All the right. Where the fuck oh. you going? I, I can't turn I right. I don't know. I couldn't steer. Good. <laughs> yeah, that, that happens in this mode. Put it in. <laughs> to the wall. It's not yeah. technically in the... Ah. <laughs> to the window. <laughs> <laughs> to the wall. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Somehow, I'm the best one on our team. Somehow. <laughs> Double digits! <laughs> Three assists, so you ran into a lot of fuckers. Um, yeah! 
<laughs> Interesting. I think uh, team wise, we did good. Three, three, two, two. It's better than six, four, four, than Pedro. Yeah. <laughs> I was in goal a lot, and to be fair. Pedro. <laughs> I mean, technically, so, so Mirror, uh, what do you, what do you call it? Like Casino Royale, like the new one and Skyfall and all those. I don't think those are in continuity with the old Bond movies. Are they? Are they trying like, any type of continuity? No. I don't, I don't know. Cause like Judy series. Dench was there and she was in the last couple of movies. Skyfall, as them. I don't know. Mm. I think Skyfall. I don't, I don't that know. Is, it, that is canon. That is canon. But the original, uh, Casino Royale isn't even included in the 007 Regar regardless my point was that like a bunch of people who play james bond show up at your house and then shoot you to death <laughs> <laughs> i don't think you're gonna be like uh zombie david niven you shouldn't be here because the original casino royale is oh no bond it'll be a great as they're gunning you down it will be a great scene in the film it'd be like well action blam yeah. <laughs> blam, blam, blam. No, no. As, as he's getting riddled with bullets, he still has enough air in his lungs to like fucking. Right. <laughs> you shouldn't. <be> here. <laughs> That's right. We're gonna close it out with some drop shot. All right. Look at Scott with this wee shit, man. What are you, a communist? <laughs> to be fair, he's been a regular over the past couple of year. Communist, got it. <laughs> Linux game communism, man. Yeah, man. The new movement. Oh, oh low bouncy. Low, low bouncy. <laughs> Good luck. Drop shot. <laughs> All right. Ooh, uh, this is just going to be a lot of like dribbling and like giant holes. Yep. Well, this is not going to be going back and forth. Kind of yeah. We get a bot. <laughs> yes. Uh, uh, nope. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Um. Aha. <laughs> 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 Boop. Alright, hit the floor, hit the floor, hit the floor. Oh, God boo. damn it, even the bot. <laughs> Bots are secret no, weapons. No, 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 no. <laughs> what? There's a no. bot? What bot? There's a, a robot. Who are we missing? It paddles. God, what the okay. hell are you trying there, old man? No. Oof. Whoosh. Okay, give me a minute and I'll figure out which side I'm supposed to hit. Um. <laughs> You're supposed to hit the yellow there. side. Yes. <laughs> Let it drop while it's pink. <laughs> Please just let the ball hit the ground. Not that ground. Yes. There we go. Whoa. Yes. No. <laughs> uh, did I touch the ball? No, I didn't touch I the ball. I did. Okay. It went the wrong way, but I touched the fuck out of it. You son of a bitch. Dylan, you <laughs> son of a bitch. I'm going to let that touch the floor now. <laughs> I don't have time for a heist. I have a truck to sell. You son of a bitch. <laughs> uh, oh, yes. Play. Yes. Aw. <laughs> oh. Nope. <laughs> Yeah, that's a f man. That was my biography right there. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Make the floor not pink. <laughs> Pro strats, man. We need to get you like by the minute. Coaching. <laughs> Did I touch it? Uh, <laughs> apparently I didn't. Up? Apparently I touched it. <laughs> Fat load of good, it actually did. Boop! <laughs> no, no. Damn it, damn it, damn it. There. Steve Harvey. There will be no getting Michael. in no holes. Damn it. Ah. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> Not in the pink hole! 
I want it in the <laughs> no yellow put hole. It in the pink. <laughs> oh, you telling me I'm creepy? <laughs> yeah, cause you say some creepy neck bird shit. <laughs> Come on, Foxy, you know that's true. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> It's not like I'm reaching here, man. <laughs> <laughs> I can just say that at the start of the show. <laughs> Statistical probability. <laughs> oh. Uh-oh. Mm. Uh. Mm. Okay, somehow I have 100 points. <laughs> oh, really? Time. Quit bragging. Yeah. Motherfucker. With your hundred points, wait, do I have more than you? I can, I can, I can like spend it on oh, tacos. I got one hundred and sixty-eight points. Scrub. <laughs> oh! oh. 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 Take it. <laughs> Who the fuck went Fozzy Bear over there? <laughs> <laughs> or Fat Albert? I don't know. <laughs> no one touched that. <laughs> they touched it. Well, I touched it, but whatever. <laughs> We, we have to keep maintain this dominating lead. <laughs> Dominated. Unanswered. Dominating. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that's a tie. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Even point distribution. Oh, that was just yeah, went in by itself. <laughs> that was petty wise. <laughs> yeah, what? Flying by it. See, my my strat to confuse the ball didn't work. <laughs> I don't think you, you gotta, want to confuse the ball. <laughs> you, gotta, you, gotta, you gotta be Listen like, no, me. ball, you're a car, you have to hit me. It was it was my cuddlefish strategy. I was trying to hypnotize it by <laughs> dancing in front of it. <laughs> hit the ground, hit the ground, Quit. hit the ground. Oh, it, it hit, it hit. Yeah. <laughs> Boost ball. Hello, Don Incognito. What were yeah. you doing in front of me? <laughs> oh, fuck oh, off. Fuck. Should've got some points for that. No, 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 no. no there's a hole there! No, 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 no. You're no, just doing this because I can't mute no, no, you right no. now. <laughs> go, 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 go. Uh, uh, over time. Okay, there's a hole there. <laughs> I will stab dicks, man. Bring it. <laughs> Dick stab us! Oh. Stabbing dicks and I don't know. Uh, yeah, go Not ahead. gonna finish that one. <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> wiener, wiener, wiener. <laughs> That's not where I was gonna go, but nope. you know what? <laughs> Regardless, too hot for Twitch. Way too hot for Twitch. Ah, there we go. Jeez. No, there we go. Okay, there we go. That, God damn it. That is what I'm talking about. That is what I am talking about. <laughs> German engineering. Is talking about the good? He's talking about Das Masterplan. <laughs> no! It's it sounds floor. bad oh, when you. you say it like that, Jordan. <laughs> is, is it just because it is bad, then? <laughs> no, that wasn't. Ah. There. Boop. Aw. Yay! Ah! Go, Pedro! Go! <laughs> More yay! Ah! Uh, Someone yeah. booted it before I did. And it's a Fuck you! Go on the outside corner. <laughs> no! Up on the downside. Oh, no, no! Yes! No, 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 no. <laughs> Please, no! no. Oof. Oh, for fuck's sake, there we go, get it come back on. in the... Come on! <laughs> Thank you, Pennywise! Come on, do I would it. boop Kill Pennywise me. into the yeah. ball if it means saving... Oh! No, 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 no! Yes! Ah. 
Oh, yes. God. Oh, the yes. Help. Extra it yes. Helps. Side of yes. <laughs> it helps. Just a little bit, but it helps. Damn it, people. <laughs> That's the ceiling. Hello. <laughs> I'm never quite sure when to use the handbrake in this. Uh, I. Hmm. When you need to turn around. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, like. I don't know. Some, sometimes. Usually when I go for the handbrake, I usually come up short, which nope. is. There it is. Yes! Oh! Bam, 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 Pennywise was technically the last one to touch it. Yep. <laughs> Don't. I'm always the last one. Does that get me by surprise? I generally got bored waiting on you fuckers to do something with it. I was like, uh... <laughs> All right, I did better than Scott. I feel I good did about myself. Than Scott. MVP, oh, motherfucker. <laughs> Scott, were you playing with your toes again? Not by much, by George, but yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Look, I did all the damage in this team, Foxy. Unlike you, Mr. 14. I touched the ball. <laughs> so fuck all you. <laughs> Bold words, Alan. You couldn't save it. It's like, it's all on me, man. Carrying the load. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> uh. uh. That was a good one. That, that was well matched on that last one. Yep. Fuck this game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bit of that, bit of that, bit of that as well, Yans. Hmm. Eon versus non Eon. Katana, have you been drinking? <laughs> Hey, Saturday night, come on. Rhetorical question time. <laughs> with your, like with your host, the film Ben Soon. Uh, <laughs> it's always fun, man. However, one might assume that after... I get it. 220 hours, I might be able to hit the damn ball by now, but... Yeah. Bleh, you'd be wrong. <laughs> you, sir or madam, would in fact, as Jordan said, be wrong. Man. Ah, so, are you, are you getting ready for that ribeye soup? Yeah, it's gonna be huh? delicious soup. Do you do soup? What type of soup do you? Um, usually I go with like uh, chicken or beef soup. Lately, like I said, lately it's been chicken just because it has better collagen content. I think what I like is like just veggie soup with. I mean bread. that that do, that doesn't surprise me. I don't really see you eating like a lot of like pork soup or Onion beef soup, soup or chicken soup <laughs> or. <laughs> I like mushroom soup. Uh, mushroom cream soup mushroom. Pretty good, actually. It's yeah. pretty good. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, I have um, kids. I need no alcohol. Yes, you. Do come on! <laughs> you, need, you need extra alcohol. I need more alcohol. I'm on the mm. I'm on my last drop of rum. That has nothing. Amir, to do with I don't know what it, what that is, but it it's growing. He's trying to prove his point about 007. All right, you just gotta you gotta look past whatever the fuck no, that is. No, it, it that's chicken stock. It's fat. Nah, it's, it's growing. It's that, oil. It, that's a pot. Yeah, it's alive. Stop. That's, <laughs> no. This is not a pot. <laughs> Listen, man, I took the safe bet. You but tried to tell me that's alive. not a pot? <laughs> it's a pot. I was just going to say. Yo, yeah, 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 man, you got some pot? Man. <laughs> like, preferably stainless? <laughs> or do you want copper? What you need, baby? I, li I like copper. I, li I like... I think, I think copper adds a nice flavor. I got some... That's not what I look for in my car. I have some copper fryware that I just never fucking use. I have cast iron, man. You don't like the taste of copper? No, no, I'm more of a cast iron flavor. Whatever that is. <laughs> <laughs> I know what kind of soup Ben likes. Stone soup. <laughs> That's called taking a bath. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and Ben totally drinks the water. Story of delicious. Stone soup. 
<laughs> mm, delicious, delicious bath water. <laughs> Human you can, tea, you can sell it on eBay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if it uh, works for Belle Delphine, it might LGC work for Ven, store. right? I, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> how, how, how is Ven's Iago? Whatever, whatever the fuck it's called, face. The what? Iago? <laughs> what, yeah. I, don't, I don't know. You I took a stab at some word, man, but it's not. It, it's, it's like a Japanese word. It's I don't the understand. Vernacular. It's, it's Iago. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> <laughs> You fucking weeb. <laughs> right? I tried. You're like, no, no, man. Connoisseur. Japanese pronunciation is not that difficult. You just need to figure out what the fuck the words are. <laughs> one, more, one more time for the people. I go. Define it, please. Country of origin. <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't know. Let, 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 let's see you do it, Pedro. Do what? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> that's, that? That's what the word means. Let's never do that again. Right? <laughs> Some of us are going to try to sleep this evening. That's not helping. Maybe a little bit, but not a lot. <laughs> so, so, Pedro, do Look, you want to sell your bathwater? water? something for someone. <laughs> right? <laughs> Like I said, Pedro, you might want to take a bath afterwards. It's gonna, there's gonna be one view on like the the four hour version of this on YouTube. That's gonna be the guy. He's gonna make that noise too. Down incognito, no man. That's just do knee. Do knee hard. No, just do a knee. Okay, do a knee. Right. It's my favorite book. I have Dune. no idea what it means, but... <laughs> I thought... Wasn't that Dune? I'll take your word for it. <laughs> yeah, Dune. Dune. Right. No, it's Dune. <laughs> Motherfucker. Learn some fucking Dutch. Uh, it's nope. <laughs> N E E. I know Vulcran is render face, but that's what the fuck's Vulcran. <laughs> Vulcran is. It's the new graphics that's API. Why? Is that like, yeah? Yeah, it, it, it's, it's derived from <laughs> Randall. <laughs> you got some new extensions in Australia they haven't been. Let me. <laughs> let me it, 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 it's an alternative me... to Rope and GL. <laughs> I, I'm just imagining like fucking Leonard Nimoy with like one crazy eye off to the left a little bit. Uh, Vulcran. <laughs> Vulcran. <laughs> It's like, damn it, Gary. Uh, no, it's Jim. Oh, Craig. <laughs> Live explain. long and crocker. Blender was, was, right. was originally coded by Dutch, so all the variables were in Dutch. One of all. Oh, look, Resonator is uh, following us. That's like Lee. <laughs> yeah, fuck you all. I was right. Good... It is neat. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Neat. Nope. It's no. no it's nope. It's but it's like neat. colloquial, right? Like it's not. It's neat. slang. Yeah. It's yeah. Sexy. I'm surprised. But I I'm guess it's like, it's like nine or nicht, or what I know. Nietzsche. Like, Nietzsche. Nietzsche. I don't know Nietzsche's a philosopher. That's about it. That's Nietzsche. Nietzsche? <laughs> yeah. Some people just pronounce it Nietzsche. Nah, dude. I like Nietzsche and Re. They're a tag team. Philosophical duo. <laughs> <laughs> Nietzsche and Re, man. Don't ask questions. Or do. I just won't answer them correctly. <laughs> It'll make Pedro do that thing with his face again. <laughs> Let's just do that. Anyways, that was a one-time right? thing. That ticket has expired. Stay tuned I don't, for the I don't think it week. has. So yeah, stay tuned. Stay tuned Tuesday when he has face cam on. Oh boy. You know oh somebody boy. brought up a like a very valid point and I was like, I bet if you were like rolling in the Harry Potter universe, you could get like a gift tattoo. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Well, so uh, they actually they actually have them in real life. Um, 
It's like a scroll that they uh, insert under your arm, and it's like a little LED thing that can... Oh, no, dude, that's not a tattoo, that's a fetish. I mean, it can be both. That's body modding at that point. (laughs) Subdermal. I mean, a a tattoo is a body modification. No, no, it's not. Not by definition. (laughs) You're modifying your body by putting a a thing on it. Sorry, you can't get that one, buddy. Why not? (laughs) Because you're redefining a fucking word. ink. <laughs> yeah, you're injecting ink. Yeah, into here's your skin. a tattoo. You shove some shit under your skin, and it's like, no, that's that's not a tattoo definition. Uh, well, the thing is called and made a tattoo. Good. It can be called whatever it wants. It can be called but I'm Gary, saying that tattoo, it's not a tattoo. tattoos themselves, tattoos themselves are a body modification. <laughs> Gary, no one's arguing that. But whatever the fuck you were talking about is not a tattoo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hey man, look, I got my ear pierced. You know, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not gonna die on this hill. You know, yeah, yeah, it's not a tattoo. <laughs> like new, it's, just the, it's just the thing you inject in your skin. Yeah, I inject. Or underneath your skin. Got some platinum right up here in my ear, man. This is my new tat. <laughs> I mean, they called the thing that uh, Teal Cat on his had a tattoo. I don't even know if that's right, isn't? What do they call it? A signet? Or... I mean, that's a relief tattoos where they actually damage the skin underneath that it causes it to regrow and actually give it some relief. <laughs> well, because it's like... Oh, the, no, the... dude, you got it, bro. Um, yeah. See, I scienced it, teal thing on head, and of course, Google. Yeah. Straight up. It's a golden tattoo. That's what they called it, yeah. Yeah, but you see, that's not under the skin, so fuck your definition of tattoo. Yeah. <laughs> I mean... All right, so, so you can just, like, tape it on your forehead and not inject it in your skin. Or underneath your skin. Indeed, Jordan. It's a tattoo. All right. thank, thank, thank you, Tilk. How, 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 how is your boy doing in ancient Norway? <laughs> what? Because he's Kratos and God of War. Oh. Ah, right. Well, you, you can think Don M for the sweater. And there's Farfetch, yeah. and then there's whatever kind of Pokemon Jordan <laughs> just tried to spin there. I'm sure it's, I can it's, get it's this It's Galarian Farfetch, it's the one with the giant, like, Lance. But Lance Lee. I give you 100% guarantee I'm going to take this to the dry cleaner at least once, just to be like, here you go. <laughs> <laughs> just I'll probably off. drop it off with my leather pants. Just... To get that combo. Let him think about that for a minute. I'm sure they've seen it all before. <laughs> and that's when you get the judgment from the person behind the counter. It's like, all right, no, you just got all right. Just, just, no, but what you gotta do is like drop before. it off plain faced, and then just as you're leaving, just scream, "Bitch, you don't know my life." Well, you see, this is gonna be me in normal streetwear, so I'm gonna be in a fucking three piece, man. So. Yeah. Yeah. Oh man, we should get you like the 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 dog gimp suit from Preacher. Oh, you mean the god suit? Ah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm here to see God. Oh, uh, I'm on a mission. No, 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 that was that was a pretty good twist. They're like, yeah, they found him right at the beginning. <laughs> yeah, there it was is. right there the entire time. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, oh, all right, well done, show, well done. Yep. Yeah, that kind of sucks. No more Preacher. I was like, can we? But, well, you know. it's it's the same people who are working on the boys, so... Yeah, we're gonna get some more boys, though, so... Clip that. That should be fun. I'm done for playing with the boys. Yeah. Playing with the boys. There's, uh, there's quite a bit of it, man. I mean, you know it's not that far off from the, uh, cartoon. The Boys, the animated series for Saturday morning. Fox nah, man, Kids. you know, it's a cartoon. It's a drawing on paper. Cartoon, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Technically, someone who, re- who uh, draws comic books is a cartoonist. Yeah, see? Yeah. yeah. In some languages, like the comics on the back of newspapers, are called cartoons. Hello, yeah. Portuguese people. How you doing? <laughs> How dare you? How dare you, sir? <laughs> Who do you have any right to address the wonderful na- nation of Portugal in such a negative way? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's almost as if I was born there or something. That's a personal problem. Actually, it's a yeah, it, you know what? It spat you out. Um, <laughs> yeah, it fucking did. <laughs> and I'm cool with that. <laughs> mm. 
All right, beautiful people, we gotta bounce the fuck up out of here, so, um, let's get the, uh, night-night music going. Jordan! What? What did we learn? Uh, we, we, we learned how to pronounce words in Japanese. And Nick faces. That one word in particular. Say, say it again, Pedro. I go. And we saw Pedro's no face. Because you see that, you're just like, nope, I'm out, <laughs> fuck this. Close the, close the browser window, shut the app off. That yeah, needs to be clipped. Th th those of you who stuck around after that, we applaud you. <laughs> <laughs> Nerves of steel. You made of tougher stuff I than I am. We will say, those people will say, oh, Scott, you're my death. Bless you, Scott, you try. <laughs> All right, oh, yes, you... I... <laughs> go, go men weebs. Um... weebs. Go men <laughs> um, All right. Matane. Tuesday, Tuesday, Pedro's gonna be back. Are you doing more uh, open move? Quite possibly, unless something really interesting shows up that I decide to buy. <laughs> and you know, there's, there's weekly, daily Wednesday on Wednesday, surprise, surprise. Wednesday, man. Cleverly disguised <laughs> after Tuesday. Uh, but before Thursday, <laughs> when you will be breaking out some fill in the blank. That probably Dicey Dungeons. All right, Those right on. That's what I was going to do uh, last week. Uh, but then you're like, hey, man, you want to do some Death Road? Yeah, we'll yeah, try it. Go back and watch that, man. Uh, there's a nice mm -hmm. super cut of the first 15 minutes. Uh, of me yeah. just getting my eardrums destroyed. I'm still hearing the ringing. <laughs> ring, ring. <laughs> Banana zombies. It's brilliant. I want to thank each and every one of you who showed up and participated in this train wreck. We like to call it Schemecast Weekly. Everyone hanging out in the after show. We get Jill, Foxy, Mir, Mr. Alert, Pity Vise, and Scott. It was kind of brilliant. Hi. It was kind of dangerous. But we're still here. Dangere. So let's die in a fuck mothering fire. Until next week. Bye bye. Bye. Toodaloo. Bye. Everybody. bye. We love you. Bye. bye. bye.